All right, we're back again. Uh, starting on World 4, we found a place to call home for the moment. And we're going to start building a starter house. And yes, I'm finding I suck at hardcore. This is what we got so far. We got a little bit of crops going on, some sugar cane. Uh, a little bit of an area back here that I'm going to expand on for building our starter house and doing something a little different I think this time um, being as we're digging into a cliff face here or a hillside that looks like it's going to continue back considerably um, I think we're going to dig it back a little bit more and do a two-story house and put some machines in finally probably go down maybe three or four steps five steps and start doing some machines back there. I'm 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 tired of playing and not having redstone machines because I like redstone machines. <clears throat> I got a viewer already. Welcome to the channel. We're 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 gonna clear some land and start on our starter house. Maybe clean up some of the stone, um, and see what we can do. But basically, we're we're back to the beginning again. Yep. I'm kind of half expecting to see Metal Cashew in the chat at some time. I tried connecting to the server he invited me to. I was going to do that for an hour or two. Um, and I couldn't connect. So I'm hoping that he comes into the stream and we can chat. And I can maybe get that. If that happens, then I'm going to end the stream probably and go check out his server. Um, and see what it looks like. All right, um, so yeah, we're going to dig this back a little bit more. I kind of want to take a look at the terrain up here first to see what I'm expecting. So it does bottom out kind of into our wood lot. So I think maybe only four more back. And we are going to dig down a little bit before we start clearing a group area underground that we're going to use for... I want machines. I'm tired of not having machines. I don't think priority is going to be dragon fight this time. I think priority this time is to get a few machines running because I miss my machines. Uh, I used to have them all the time when I was doing just a regular survival world with deaths allowed. <laughs> I haven't had a single machine in any of the hardcore worlds. I've had some really basic manual farms, semi-automatic farms, and that's about it. So I haven't had a chance to check out or explore much of this world. Don't know what it has to offer. We found a few things along the way that will help, obviously. Really? I can't hit that? That's lame. Um, we're basically just starting off. I think I played on this, this world now for about two hours. I had Gamer in the chat, Gamer, Game Timer in the chat last night, keeping me company while we explored the world, tried to find a home. And, yeah. yeah. That should despawn on its own. I don't need to worry about it. Go back to doing this. We've got dark oak in the area, we've got jungle in the area, uh, we've got birch, we've got oak and spruce. So we've got all the woods we want, and we just need to go collect a bit of it and bring it back. We've got some of it planted already on our wood lot, so that's, that's good, we'll expand that. Probably going to have to uh, level up some more ground so I can expand the wood lot, and, and yeah. <clears throat> And that was the end of my shovel, so we'll get some more. Kind of want to cook up some of this stone so that we've got some stone available for crafting. So we'll just do that much for now. We don't need a lot for devices or, or things in the beginning, so I'm not going to do too much. 
Uh, I am going to unload some of this so it doesn't take up room. We can go down and plant that while we're thinking about it. So we got cows over there. I should keep up on them, actually. Um, that'll be our main food source, as usual. Uh, until we get some farmers going and some golden carrots and such. But that'll be a while. I found one village. It was really kind of lame. There was, uh, what, four, maybe five buildings. No treasure chests. And, yeah, we left a, a fairly in a hurry to go explore. So I'm going to have to take a look around and see if we can find a better village to get some villagers from. Because that one was way over, I think, that way, closer to spawn. We've traveled a fair bit trying to find a simple little place to call home. <clears throat> we'll see. Now that we're calling it home, we got to see if we can make it look like a home. So, oh, shovel would help. Um, so I'm probably going to spend most of the stream just putting together a basic starter house. Um, first and second floor. Uh, living quarters on the top, storage and work area on the bottom, and then likely back in the area that we dig out here that goes down into our our machine area. Uh, we're probably going to have a mine that goes down as well. Um, unless in our roaming and building we find a nice big open cave that we can use. I haven't found a lot of iron so far. Uh, did find one treasure ship, didn't have much in it. Uh, the ocean here seems to be kind of small. We made the whole perimeter of it. We went all the way around the, the outside of it. Found one tra or two sh two ships. Uh, one had moss in it. That was that was good. Uh, the other one had some gold uh, and some iron nuggets. So we made ingots out of it, and I think that was about it. There was no treasure maps, unfortunately. Um, there's buried treasure map. There was an empty map there. We left some stuff in the uh, treasure ships because, well, the sunken ships because we just didn't have room in our inventory. So we could go back and clean that up later. But right now, I kind of want a place with a roof and some walls where we can work in peace. Maybe get some torch lighting up around the area so that we can run around in peace even at night. But that isn't a priority at the moment. Okay, so the idea is we're just going to build right into the, the, the cliff. And build up a house. And it's not going to be... I don't think it's going to be a really fancy. Have we got dirt on us? I want kind of want to fill some of this in. Uh, let's see how that looks for space. We could do bigger back there in a little bit of a front entrance way, I think. All right. Uh, we need materials. We haven't got a lot, so I'm going to go cut down some trees. Check and see what we've got first, I guess. Um, we do have trees growing in the back in our wood lot at the moment, uh, but there's really not a lot of them. Uh, we should take some coal, some more coal with us, maybe. We got some spruce, we got a little bit of dark oak. There is a dark oak forest over that way, I believe. We'll go take a look at that, get some more trees. Uh, when we got the dark oak, we only got one sapling out of the tree and I didn't want to stick around to wait for the rest of it to despawn. So we just threw out the sapling, we needed room. We can always get more. Um, okay, I'm gonna go and collect some wood. We've got stone, sticks, Maybe a little bit more stone. I don't know how much material we're going to go through in the way of tools. We should have everything else we need. So I think we'll head over through the ocean or by ocean to the dark oak first. I'm going to want a fair bit of that. I'm going to go for like a, a cabin in the woods type thing. Not cabin, but a house in the woods type thing. <clears throat> all right so we'll pick a spot in here and just start clearing out a forest i'm not too worried about replanting at the moment maybe we'll push back off this stony shore a bit and just take everything we can get uh, normally i would replant but 
with dark oak uh not really a big i uh, big deal because i mean they're so close together usually So yeah, I went back through the video of my death on World 3, and I think the biggest mistake I did was, being as it was new chunks being loaded in an area that was entirely uh, lava underneath, there was a lot of mob spawns. Uh, I did notice the lot of mob spawns, and I didn't do anything about it before I ran in to get to the blaze spawner. Um, I should have done bow action a lot more and try and find a path that could have given me uh, a narrow hallway to use for a three, uh, a block three high up that I could run under, but that the wither skeletons couldn't get through. Because when that group of four came around the corner and ambushed me, I basically was out in the wide open. Oh, we didn't bring a crafting table. Uh, in the wide open with all four of them having access to me at the same time and of course didn't last very long. So for improvement sake for next time, uh, that part at the very least needs to be done better. Yep. Uh, we got night coming on already? We do. Alright, well let's do this first then. What do you mean it is night? Give me the bed. I want to sleep. Thank you. All right. Some more oak. Uh, we'll take some back. We're going to want that in our wood lot for sure because I expect to use a lot of it. Or a fair bit. Uh, we're going to need a lot of spruce as well. We've already got spruce in the wood lot, but it's not grown yet. It's not really big. So I'm going to go find a mountain that should be actually uh, just off up the slope from where our home is and get a bunch more spruce and then we got oak around we've got oak in our woodlot and it grows pretty fast so we shouldn't need any more of that and i think that's all we're going to need for the house we'll use that and uh probably either cobble or some stone brick or something uh make the the first floor uh look solid sort of thing uh, with the stone and then uh, wood highlights and then the top floor will be lighter colored and airy and so on and there'll be a kind of a front entrance way with uh, a small roof over top of it as well to break up the, the roof line a little bit but we'll see how it goes I found that even my starter houses tend to take a while I'm not real quick at it I don't know if it's because I don't have enough experience building them or if it's uh, just me being too particular about what I'm looking for. How are we doing on saplings? We got three, almost a tree's worth. Four, there we go. Now we got another tree we can take home with us. I figure about three stacks of this should be enough. So we'll clear back the forest. If we end up with a lot of saplings, then we'll replant some. Uh, I don't want to leave a massive bare space in here. It just looks bad when you're going by in the boat. But I figure off the stony shore from the ocean, you're really not going to notice uh, if it's only the edge of the forest that's taken out. So some place to store our stuff better than a chest out in the open. Some place with a bed uh, and a work area. And then some mining is the plan. I don't know how much of it's going to get done, but we'll see. Uh, we'll let that despawn and come back to it. We'll go over this side, I guess. There's a hole? No, just a divot. Yeah, it's too bad. I was really kind of thrilled when we actually found the nether fortress in that world 3. Um, we had to look a bit to get it. But we found it, and I was all hyped to get some experience at blaze rods. 
and then got swarmed and just didn't react right to it. And I'll never get to know whether or not my idea for a jungle wood build was going to work well. The starter, the, the first part of it that I put together was good. I liked it. I was looking forward to seeing whether or not it fleshed out to a, a really good one afterwards. Like with the, the second floor. But uh, we'll have to do that another time. Um, I guess we'll just keep going around the edge here. How many are we doing here? We got three stacks almost. found in both of the last two worlds experience has been kind of an issue xp for enchanting mainly um obviously because it's always early game so that's part of the reason i want to start getting some machines and farms going because with even just a few villagers uh farmers particularly in the beginning you can make quite a bit of xp and I've been for, foregoing that simply because of the effort it takes to build up the trading hall, get the zombie, and do all that. But I think it would be a worthwhile endeavor to get started on early, particularly with the farm, so you've got quantity to be able to trade with the villagers. Um, that means every effort that you make with the villagers along the way is just that much more beneficial to you. <clears throat> Oh, and I was thinking about it after I shut down last night. Kelp. We need kelp. Uh, kelp is good XP if you're doing it in quantity. You can store it up until you need it. And not having to go mining for coal is good as well. Concentrate on other minerals instead. Always having to constantly mine for coal. It can be... Well, I mean, it could slow you down. Uh, if that's the only torch material you've got and the only cooking material you've got, it can really slow you down. We should go check and see how many saplings we're getting from those other trees we got chopped down. Hello, pig. Um, yeah, we'll leave you alone. We got cows now. Uh, here, let's do this so I can get a count. We got anything more over here? We got another one. We got another one up there. Oh, we're getting a few. Nice. Okay, so we are looking like maybe we will replant some of this. Maybe one tree for every three that we've taken down. We've got better than four stacks. Um, one more tree, I think, should be enough wood for what I've got in mind. Uh, especially if we've got a wood lot that's supplying us more afterwards. And thinking about the stonework on the starter house, I think I'd prefer to use andesite, to be honest. I like the texture of it better than any of the stone or cobble options. <clears throat> I'm glad I brought more stone with me, or cobblestone with me, because we've just used up what I originally had in axes already. So, maybe digging out a little bit behind the starter house, where tunnels and machines might go, will yield some andesite. Maybe we'll check out some caves along the way. See if we could see some kind of surface andesite available. How many have we got now? We got 32. That's eight new trees. So let's replant a few of them. Uh, we'll do one here. Let it grow. Uh, one here. Let it grow. And one here. Let it grow. We've still got five left. Probably get another couple off of this. Let's take the rest of this tree so it doesn't look weird. 
Um, kind of want to wait for this. Let's take some oak. We'll get this out of the way. Maybe speed up the despawn of that other stuff and maybe help it along too. <clears throat> And then uh, I think next on the list is going to be go get some spruce. And that should be back that way. We'll just trek through the bush, see if we find anything interesting along the way. And once we're done with that, we should be close to the top of the hill behind our starter house anyway. So, yep, should be all right. Kind of looking to see if there's any big open caves along the way that we can exploit. And we got a few more. I think plant one more. If we could get, what, three more, that would be ideal. Let's see about uh, getting up and helping these ones along. Just to satisfy curiosity, I guess. Oh, are we not going to get any? We might not get... We got one. There's... Okay, I think that's the three we need. That gives us an even number of trees. We can plant one, take the rest home. I think. Did we get all that? We did. All right. Uh, we got more than enough. All right. Good enough. We will do that. I think... Yeah, uh, with the... Oh, okay. Once those trees grow, you almost wouldn't even know that we were here. All right, we're going to go back this way, see what we can find. There is a lot of dark, so we might find mobs. I've got a shield, though, so I should be good. I'm kind of looking to see if there's an opening to any really interesting caves. That don't look like they're going to kill us on the first few steps. Uh, this is an interesting cave. Kind of, maybe. Meh, not really that interesting. Okay, skip. Moving on. And looking like we're going to be sleeping soon. Let's see if we can get up someplace with a view so we know where we're heading. I'm not sure exactly where I'm heading. I know it's in this general direction. Yeah, all right, jungle forest back there. So we could see that from the top of the hill behind our uh, uh, starter shack. So we'll go get some bamboo, that'll be good. I don't really need any uh, jungle at the moment. I don't expect to use a lot of it on the starter house anyway. It does go well with uh, dark oak, strip dark oak particularly. So I might come back and get some in the future for other builds, but not for the starter house. We will just use well, the three mains, I call it. It's spruce, oak, and dark oak. Just seeing if there's any surface iron available. I like the coal. Uh, we've got a fair bit of it back home, though. Um, we've been picking up surface iron so far to supply us with the one piece of armor that we've got. And an iron pick. And a bucket. That's how much we've picked up. I haven't found any tall mountains yet, uh, the extreme ones, extreme hills, snowy peaks, those all tend to have some good amount of iron in them, but we just, uh, we, we, we hadn't found any yet. All right, I think that's a good spot to get some bamboo from. So we'll do that. Oh yeah, we're getting, we're so good at this. I keep trying to time it and I fail miserably. Uh, don't need much plant it back home in some out of the way place so we don't have to look at it. Making bamboo look good inside of a build, kind of hard. Um, it really doesn't fit with like an alpine look at all or a woodsy look. Fits well with a jungle look, obviously, but that's about it. Alright. Um. It's almost a stack. That should be plenty. Where'd our boat go? Alright. Um, 
thinking. I think we'll go back over here and continue on that way. <clears throat> Just so I got my bearings. Yeah, we'll continue on this way. This should be following the shore. Ocean should be over there. Uh, see what's in the bush. See what's outside of the bush. Ah, zombie. This is our first mob. This is our first mob. Hello, buddy. Welcome to my party. What do we got here? Oh, this is a cave. Uh, some eats would be good, I think. And then... Did we not? We didn't make any torches. That, okay. Well prepared. Yep, we're good at this. Uh, oh, we did. I'm just an idiot. All right. Um, let's go on and see what we can do here. Yeah, go go kill the zombie or the skeleton. Both of you go kill the skeleton. There you go. I'll worry about you guys afterwards. Got another skelly bob bouncing around over there. I'll sneak in behind you to get this side. Yeah, go 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 kill him. Go kill. Him. Where'd you go? Oh, you got killed. All right. Ow! Come on, zombie, kill him. You didn't kill him. Ow. Is there two? There's two of them. Three of them. Alright, let's get some lights in here if we can. I'm looking for andesite mainly. If I can find other interesting things, I will do that. Excuse me. Um, that's interesting. Not really what I was kind of looking for, but... Okay, we got... There you go. I'll do it the easy way until I've got better gear. Just want to make sure I'm seeing everything that I want to see here. I want the andesite. I kind of want to see what's down here. Uh, more iron would definitely be in our, be in our favor. Uh, no luck with that, though. All right, let's get some andesite. Uh, might need two or three stacks. We've got plenty of cobble with us, so I'll make more tools uh, if we run out. Oh. How you doing, Epic? You're draining a, a monument on your own. Um, do you need sponges? Because uh, I've got a number of them. Whoop, that wasn't what I thought it was. Coal will take, I guess. Nope, I think I have sponges just... Glass wall is too large and I need extra hands. Glass wall is too large and you need... Oh, okay. Uh, I'll probably be on Restland later on in the evening. I can maybe stop by and see how you're doing. I do... I think I do have a fair bit of extra glass um, that I could probably give you at that point. But I won't be on Restland for probably at least a couple of hours. You only have one. Other. Who, who's the other person you're working with? Venom. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll check in with you when I get on Restland later on. And if you're still grinding away, I'll bring some supplies. Um, and come and help. And, and maybe some of the stream viewers will come along and help. Is it alright if you get a, like a whole bunch of people in there helping out? Like what stage are you at right now? Just a wall around it?
You're an ocean. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, so the elders are dead, but you're basically just starting on the clearing process. Kurz Online. Yeah, I'm playing hardcore. Um, I'll be on Restland later on, probably, for a couple of hours. But my, it won't be for a couple of hours, at least. I'll be here for a bit. First day of school today. Starts in an hour. Ooh, that sounds gross. <laughs> uh, haven't even started on the glass wall. Too large for two less hands. Um, okay, well, Shadow, I've still got the conduits that you loaned me. I don't have need of them anymore. Is it all right if I loan them to Epic so he could clear his monument? Sure. Okay. Uh, epic. In along with the glass when I get on, I will bring the ingredients for building up uh, four conduits. And we'll put them in the four corners inside uh, the monument area. And you'll have water breathing for the whole thing. Uh, the other thing I'll bring along is a bunch of glass. And that should get you started at least. A couple of stacks. Do you, You're going to need like five or six shulkers full. I'll see what I can bring. <laughs> yeah, you got a ways to go, my friend. A ways to go. All right, we're going to need some light in here, I think, before too long. Even just to see what we're doing. Oh, iron. I like uncovering iron. I need iron. Oh, that's fine. A lot of people do that. 55k at a certain point in the game, 55k for a warp is pretty cheap. So a lot of people just do a warp instead of a set home. I'd still like to know who set up Warp Core, because it was not me, and I haven't found out who it was yet. <laughs> I've asked on just about every stream since, still don't know. Okay, well, what's the Warp, Epic? Um, that way I can get there easier when I get online. There was a two-week period when warps were free. Man, there must have been an overload of warp set at that point. There's already a crazy number. Um, another monument might be handy, Epic, but only for the reason to leave it untouched, pretty much, so that I can go in and get uh, materials to fulfill a BP, like a battle pass quest. That's the only time I could see me needing it, really. Uh, and, I mean, in a case like that, I'd probably say just leave it for the next guy. Uh, I really don't need two. I don't need those, I guess. We'll take this. Yeah, and it gave it back to me anyway. Of course it did. Emeralds, and I can get you a monument map for you. Yeah, I don't think I need one at the moment. Save your emeralds for something else you need. 15 warps. Well, I remember when the GUI was available for warps. The warps GUI. And that thing was like 12 pages long. It was crazy. Because it was too hard. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> I've only ever cleared one uh, woodland mansion in all of the Minecraft that I've played. And I gotta say, that was... Whoa, that's a nighttime thing. That was, that was an endeavor to clear that thing. 
Spokio got the Woodland Mansion. Is there only one on the server? I, w I wouldn't be surprised if there's only one on the server. Um. Okay, we're done in here. Let's go see what else we got. I gotta figure out which way was home. Uh, um, I'm not even sure now. We'll just go until we see the ocean, I guess. The warps GUI was removed because you could take stuff out of the GUI using Q. Oh, I didn't know that. Um, Rest had put that it was removed because uh, uh, the developer wasn't updating the GUI for 1.18. That issue that you mentioned could be part of the reason that he didn't want to update it or didn't want to use it anymore. Ooh, what's here? Water again. Why, why Why? always water? Like, so many of these deep caves just go down to water. That looks like moss. That is. So, uh, there's a lush cave right here. I've got moss already. The only thing I don't have is spore blossoms and glowberries. Uh, I think max two, but one spokios. Okay. Yeah, the GUI did have some bugs. I remember going through the GUI a number of times. Uh, just like basically, ah, well, that hurt. Um, I thought that was a solid line all the way up. Okay. Uh, we're, I'm not doing that. I've already done this and I didn't want to do this. Uh, I guess we could follow this up. How far does this get us? Okay, well, that's not bad. Yeah, I was using, uh, like, I was I, I was looking for old and forgotten warps to shops that had ridiculously low prices on ridiculously OP gear. Um, found a bit, yep. Kind of looking for a cave that we might be able to use for a mining venture as well. Hello, creeper. All right, where are you? All right, good enough. That was the iron I wanted anyway. Uh, this was looking interesting. Or is this a dead end? Nope, not yet. It is a down though. Down is usually good. Can we just put a uh, granite block there? And then do that, and then dig this one down. So we got our way up. That's, uh, that's pretty good, and it's a down that doesn't really take us to much of anything. What level is this though? 42, not good enough for me to use as a mine. I might just do a mine under the house, or beside and under the house. Keep it local, keep it simple. And this is water, sort of? Coming from here, let's get rid of that. It was when Valentine's crates were just released. Okay, or I could get you a map core for your base. I don't mind getting you a map and just max it so you can have a map of your base on hand if needed. Um, yeah, I've got some changes i want to make to the map setup that i've got i kind of want to make two of them uh I, so i will need maps along the way um i think the only thing holding me back on maps at the moment is my paper supply uh, i've got plenty of iron and redstone already so i might take you up on that and i do have a number of emeralds uh, like a number of emeralds so i can give you like emeralds to get me maps that's easy uh where was my up right there i just need emeralds but i can get maps for your base okay uh when i get on i'll bring a supply of emeralds with me as well here hang on i'm i'm making a list because it's getting too long for my brain to keep track of so we got uh Conduits, uh, glass, and emeralds. And yeah, I'll get some maps for from you for sure, because I want to do up a map board 
<clears throat> in behind like a billboard style in behind warp core so that when people warp in they can see the map and see the updates to the map and see the development of the whole atlantis island going um where do i want to go up here i want to go up here i guess is that it down it's just coal uh because I figure that at least while the monument's getting built, and even possibly afterwards, that warp core area is going to be a place where people come to uh, just kind of watch things happen. Uh, Got to go in 10 minutes. Okay, Shadow, I'll have fun at school. I know it's first day, so fun is rare on the first day, but... Um... Okay, I don't know if I have carrots. I haven't got any gardens growing except my uh, um, sugar cane at the moment. Everything's been kind of focused on, on getting started on that monument and getting it done. Uh, I Yeah, as far as the starter base goes on Restland, it's it kind of piss poor to be honest. I should eat. Because that's an issue. Uh, Cor, I want you to become my math teacher. Um, no. I'm not taking responsibility for somebody else's learning. <laughs> nope, not doing that. Uh, am I actually picking up spruce? Or is it getting left behind? Where is the spruce? Oh, it's right there. Carrots and kit food on wrestling oh uh, you know what i do have a ton of i do have a ton of bones uh so maybe i can bring you a supply of carrots uh we should bring some more saplings for spruce too because i'm going to need them for the woodlot give you one of my pumpkin carvers to farm it if you need one Pumpkin carvers. What, what what does a pumpkin carver have on it? Fortune? I think I've got a pumpkin carver already. Uh, I can't remember, but I'm pretty sure I've got pretty much a full set of uh, Halloween armor and everything and tools in my PV1. I'm pretty sure that's part of what rest recovered for me from my old base that got reset and cleared. Fortune 15 and Harvest 3. Yeah, I think I've got one already. I'll look when I get back home. Yeah, so our base should be like down in there somewhere. Yeah, there's our garden. Okay. Um, I want some more spruce if I can get it. Let's see how many we're getting here. Uh, have we got a full stack of... No, we'll get some more. All right. I was kind of half expecting for metal to show up in chat when I started streaming. Uh, we were going to play on his server for a little bit today. But I tried to connect to it earlier and I couldn't get in. Well, actually it was showing up as not connected. So I was kind of hoping he'd show up in chat so we could get that arranged. But we'll have to see. If he doesn't, that's okay. We could do it another day. Um, because he's been trying to get me to play on his server for a little bit for like a week now, so. I don't think I'll stream it, though. Um, just because I don't know if it's a good idea be, with his age, if, uh, that's out in the public domain sort of thing. All right, give me more saplings. That's the only reason I'm waiting around here. I guess I could chop down more trees. Got nine saplings. I kind of want to replant some of this because it looks gross. But I haven't really got enough of that yet. Oh, and another axe gun. I'm definitely glad I brought more cobble with me. Uh, axe. Thank you. And break. Yeah, if you need maps or something like that, ask me and I can get you some because I have a couple of cartography villagers. Just need more villagers to get all my tables and all filled. Okay. 
100 sub goal face reveal. 100 sub goal. Dude, I can't even accept subs. That is so far in the future that I might, I might even say yes to that because it's so far in the future that the face might actually become pretty by the time it happens. <laughs> Um, all right. Yeah, we're getting nighttime. I'm not full full, but I'm good. I do want to plant a few of these back though. So kind of spaced out so it doesn't look like we've just ravaged the wilderness. Right, that's snow. I can't plant on snow. I do need to sleep. Follow goal. You said sub though. I'm going to hold you to that. I got, uh, oh, I got three viewers. Oh, yeah, that would be epic, and okay. Uh, actually, it looks like I got another follower, too. Oh, epic just followed. Okay, I thought you were already a follower, epic. Okay, Shadow. Have, uh, well, have fun at school. Even though it's first day, that's hard. Okay, I am going to break that because there was something on it. Where was it? I'm going to head back home, drop off our loot, maybe go for a mining run. Uh, that's not home. Home is this way. Uh, yeah, I did. I just had to get another account. So, haha. -ha. Okay. The, what, your original account just wasn't working or? There's some, there's a, I, I agree with you that t Twitch is weird. There's definitely some aspects of Twitch that looks like a mining cave to me uh that i have not figured out yet and they don't behave rationally oh that's a water filled one what a waste all right this rabbit's going to yeet himself off a cliff because i'm here uh okay so this is this is our, 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 our village, our home is right down there. So this is what we're building into and up. I like this area out of all the areas I checked simply because I like the gradual elevation change. It means you could build roads, paths up and, and get roof line variation with the buildings that you put up those roads and paths. But again, I got to last longer than a hundred days in hardcore for that to happen. So we'll see what happens. Oh, speaking of which, day check, 15. All right. Uh, looks like a mining cave to me five seconds later. Yeah, that's a water cave. Yep. I, the number of times that I find something that looks deep enough for me to get down and do some good mining, and it turns out to be filled with water. 1.18's got some excellent caves. It's also got a lot of water-filled junk that I can't use for anything. I don't have a bow yet, so that can go up. All the logs can go up. We're going to need them. Block of coal. Um, we only got 53 spruce. All right, that's unfortunate. Uh, raw iron. How much have we got now? Just the three. That makes five. That's a helmet, at least. We might do that just because I need... Well, no, we're going to find more iron. We'll wait till we got a full batch to cook. Dark, oh, dark oak, we need to plant. We need to work on the woodlot some. So we got room to plant all this fun wood that we just picked up. Um, and we need to feed the cows. I need beef in my diet. Cow, 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 cow. Yep, two cows. All right, put that away. Uh, eat some. Uh, being as we are so low, I think I'm going to have to expand the garden area because this is not going to be enough. I think I might just put it right here. Take this down. Turn this whole stone area into a garden area.
Ah, uh, stone tools. Just... All right. Um, we'll fix that up in a little bit so that we've got a bigger garden area that kind of fits better with the whole look. I want to see about getting trees planted first. And that should be back up in here. We're going to have to make this bigger. So spruce is grown. That's nice to see. What else have we got back here? I don't want to just go level out the land because that's just a lame way of doing it. Uh, but if I could level out a chunk of land to put a different type of tree up. It's a problem you get when you build in mountains. It's never flat. Uh, this is not too bad over here, actually. Maybe I'll put the dark oak down here. Uh, we can leave that as a barrier, and we'll just put them down here, yeah. So our woodlot is going to be kind of spread all over the place due to the terrain, but that should be alright. Okay, um, I think this should be the last one for here. I want to wait for some despawn before I plant trees, because that tends to mess things up. If they grow too fast, uh, maybe I'll help it. Should be good here let's grab some uh, oh this is gross all right and let's plant oh where's our dark oak right there okay uh one, two. actually do we want to do just a block i think i want to do just a block of dark oak instead of individual trees. Maybe we'll do two blocks of dark oak. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll do two more. Go. And we'll do it again over here. So that should be six of each. All right. That should be a goodly amount of dark oak when it grows up. We'll see if we can go expand the spruce one a little bit. Got enough to do that with, too. And then that should be our wood needs for a while. I think the oak one is already big enough. In fact, we might want to clear it now and replant so that uh, we can use the wood that we get. But let's get this and then see whether or not we can just make a one big block type thing.
Why no talk? Ah, well, all I'm doing is cutting down trees. Hi, Buggy Boo. Um, looking to expand the woodlot. I was talking, but then it looks like uh, Epic left the, the chat. I don't know, he might still be in there. Um, I died on my other hardcore world, so I started this one at like 1 a.m. last night. So I think I'm only about two hours into the, the world itself. Starting from scratch again. I suck at hardcore. Uh, all right, let's clear some of this out to see where we got room for. Oh, we got another one. So pretty much all I've done this stream is cleared out some more area for where the starter house is going to go and going around and collect saplings of wood for the trees I want in my wood lot that we're going to build from. Now I'm just expanding the wood lot a little bit to... Uh, Plant some more spruce trees than what I have. Where is my food? No, that's not what I want. I want my bed. So how you doing, Buggy Boo? Are you playing playing Minecraft right now, or are you just sitting and chilling? Actually. I kind of want these ones gone so that this doesn't happen again. Good. Just chilling. All right. Yep. I was going to do that today. I've been playing a lot of Minecraft. I've been streaming a lot lately for like the last 22 days or so. And I was thinking, you know, I should just sit back and have a chill day somehow. That didn't last long. Uh, I'm back to playing Minecraft again. All right, how are we doing over here? Is this going to be workable? This is this is a strange shape, to be honest. Uh, okay, well, let's make it a better shape. Um, kind of like that, only back a little bit more. Oh, that was my shovel gone. Okay, another shovel. Stone tools, gotta love it. We haven't even got, okay, we've got one piece of armor and one iron pickaxe and a bucket. That's how much iron we've found so far. We need to work on that. I'm gonna see if I can't make this a little fatter to allow for more spruce to be planted. Yeah, that should work. I got enough dirt for this. I, I don't have enough dirt for this. It's sad. All right, that should do. Uh, we might as well make this a solid one because that's just gonna be house wall anyway. So let's see what I can do with, ah, I missed that one with this. A few more saplings, a few more saplings. Oh, there's the rest of my dirt. Where is, yeah, that's what I want. Uh, that should be good. All right, let's do some serious spurs on these two. Uh, no, let's do it away because we need a light anyway. Yeah. Good enough. See how much of it grows. Uh, we'll put some torches down to aid in that. Do do lich, do do lich, and do lich. Uh, okay, so woodlot done. Um, back is going to be 
and a site i think so well actually no what i think we want dark oak in there just strip dark oak paneled up maybe with the odd spruce as a break in the look so we got spruce that's not spruce and we'll put those away as well don't need the dirt don't need the birch might need the oak all right i think what do we got here one two wait one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen fifteen's pretty good that's a nice wide inside and we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven before we really hit edge and then it can narrow into a front section okay so that gives us just a wide open on the back uh what four tall five tall what do i want five tall or four tall it's gonna have to have a storage area in it so five tall one uh here hang on we'll do this there we go Is that five? I think that was five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, okay, so that's what we want. We should probably do it three at a time. And the whole wall will just make wood paneling. We're gonna punch holes in it for a little bit of decoration, and we're also gonna punch holes in it for doors that will lead to other stuff back in the mountain. That we're going to build up but for now it's just a wall uh one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven uh i want two more i think actually we'll make it that many more and cover up all the stone right yes all right we'll do oh, i should have done this first hang on need no Give me that. I should bring this all the way up. And I'm probably going to run out of dark oak on this batch. Yep. Uh, where? There we go. Oh, we got some. I should do cows. Keep up on that. Sugarcane's not quite grown. Actually, you know what I'm not going to do? Yeah, I guess I should. I need the seeds. I'm going to expand the garden shortly, but not quite yet. This just isn't enough room. It was enough to get the cows and the vegetables started, but that's about it. So we'll save those for expansion. We'll go feed cows. Where's it? Wait, what? Where, where are we? There are we. Cows. Cows? Who wants to get laid? There you go. You're all. Okay, you're good. Uh, more dark oak. Okay, so we'll finish that wall. That'll include the outside part of it, but I think we're going to detail it with... Another secondary wall on the outside a little bit. We need to eat. All right, what do we got here? Stripped can go there. And then that can go there. And we continue. What do we... Oh, tree. Uh, tree needs to go then. That's going to be a problem. tree what's a tree all right so that should be that side this side's gonna go where are we gonna go I think we've got 15 on that one one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen here's gonna probably be eleven then 
give us some good s oh wait we want the front entrance but it can stretch out this way so yeah 11. so that's one no we want 11 on the inside two three four five six, seven eight nine ten eleven oh i missed one okay that should be 11 on the inside and one for the front wall. Oh, axe dead. Dead axe. And another one. Gonna have to go get more cobble, maybe? All right. Um, One more layer. Nope, this way. All right, so that simply inside wall will break it up and detail it later. I think inside wall for the next for the uh, the rest of it is going to be just the same. It's going to be a second floor added to it, but I want to get the first floor done first so we can move our chests inside and then go from there. Um, going to have a front entrance, separate uh, roof line. That'll be considerably smaller, and we might have to stretch this in. Oh no, I guess two away would work. Let's see what it looks like when I'm done, though. Um, oh, I went. Did I go one too far? I went one too far. Uh, yes, I did. Okay, so we'll do that. Are we getting to... It feels dark time. It feels dark time. Dark time is sleep time for now. We got to get some uh, torches up. I want to be able to work through the night. Waste a lot of Minecraft days by sleeping every night. But mobs and such. Oh. And... I guess we might as well use that one and then more needed and that is almost all of the dark oak that we brought with us okay so we're gonna have to wait till how are we doing on dark oak do i see some growing over there now i do all right Yeah, I knew that was coming. It still shocked me. Uh, are you kidding? We're not going to have enough for this? <laughs> Lame. Oh, I missed. one here not good and the rest of it looks all right we'll just uh we'll do that all right so that's just inside wall we will need to face it up with an outside wall and probably break it up a little bit with some decoration like maybe spruce would spruce work um we need an entrance way. The entrance building is going to be kind of a two part with the balcony on the second. So, how do I want to do that? Uh, actually, I think I kind of want entrance way like this and then in. So, but smaller. Um. 
So if we were to go like considerably smaller, that would be three in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, which would put seven on the inside. That is reasonable. This is kind of unreasonable, but it's going to be a big work area. So, uh, and then I think I'm going to have to break this up or break this up or fill it in, fill it probably. Um, so we got seven, I think one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes. Come out. What do we got here? One, two, three, four, five is a good number. So that means we're going to be going down here. So I do want to fill that in a little bit with some dirt then. I'm not too worried about the floor. I'm going to dig it out, put some, some, some wood in or something, but, uh, I just got to figure out sizing and actually we're going to want something on the front part so we don't have to worry about a foundation i think too so maybe two lines of this whoop and two lines too deep there all right i don't want to have to double jump so and then how wide is this one two three four five so that's good except we're only using part of it so we're going to need to one one, two, three. Yeah, we're going to need to fill in that a little bit. That should be enough. Do a little bit of lead into it, I guess. Ah. Okay, I don't know how the entrance is really going to work, but if we do... Uh, did we get the bottom one? We did. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then I think four more. No more, because we got no more. What is this then? Oh, strip dark oak. We can put that down. All right. Uh, last one. Oh, that is not what I wanted. That is what I wanted. All right. Uh, where did we get to? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, I think. And that's the outside wall, so that makes the inside odd, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, that doesn't. So we'll bring it back one. We'll put it out one. We'll put it out one. And then this should be five. One, two, three, four, five for three in the middle. And then we come this way with a front door here. I don't know if we'll do a double door. No, we won't do a double door. Everything else is single. So that's just a three wide front entrance way that comes to there, I think. And that leaves us one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes. And then we go along the front to meet up over there. And this one we're going to make lower than that one. Uh, I haven't figured out roof line yet, though. Oh, we went way too far. What the hell is wrong with me? Uh, All right, there was another one that I left behind here. Where'd it go? Right there. All right. Use those first. Is that what this is? Yes. All right, so... Oh, we need this. We're going to use up another axe. Are we out of wood? Oh my god, really? We're so close. All right. Cows! Oh, I landed in the middle of the cows. Um, well, that's awkward. I guess we'll do this one first then. We're going to break another axe.
Yep. And oops. What do we got going on here? Okay, a little bit more dark oak. That'll be the interior walls. We'll bulk out the interior walls to decorate for outer walls. Kind of a facing. Uh, and then I think we're ready for a little bit of decorating on the inside and uh, uh, creating a storage area and work area and so on. And the idea is, being as we're backing up against the cliff with our house, uh, we're going to expand things like the smelting area back into the cliff, so it's all surrounded by stonework. I think that kind of makes sense with the feel. Um, and then we're going to put a second floor on it for living area, maybe do up a kitchen area. Um, I don't know, the enchanting area, I think I might want to do outside again. Uh, I've done it a couple of times now. I really like the look. But here it's going to be a lot harder to torch it up and make it safe than the other place that we were at um on the last world so have to wait and see on that This should be all we need for dark oak, I think, for this part. We'll replant and finish up that inner wall. Oh, did I leave? I left floaters up there. That was smart. Yeah. Can I get floaters? Give me floaters. Come on. There you go. Oh, yeah. Wow. We are ripping through axes. Uh, nighttime. In a dark forest. Okay, I uh, think after this inner wall is done, before I start figuring out how the rest of it's going to go, I am going to take a quick break. I need more coffee, um, so i got to go put the coffee pot on. Uh, yeah, give me all that. I want them all. Oh, this is going to... Yeah, I hope we got enough back. Got enough for one. Let's see if we can help it out some. I normally like to have my wood lot spread out so that when I chop down a, a, a block of wood like I just did, there's no chance that the leaves are going to be touching anything else, so I, they, they all just despawn. But yeah, I got to fix up the wood lot, I guess. Okay, how many we got now? That's two. I guess that's a start. I don't want to have to come back here and check for sap on the uh, We got enough for... Okay, we got enough for four trees. Uh, that should be good enough to replant, I think. And then... I guess we can widen out this wood lot later. Mm. We only got a little bit over here to do, right? Is this where it was? Yeah. Uh, this is only three high. Uh, with a peaked roof, that should be okay, I think.
don't really need it that high. The, the storage area, which is going to be high, is going to be back in this section. Uh, this might be work area opening into storage area uh, and furnace area. But I don't think we need to go any higher with this. So door's going to be on this side. So we're going to come up from here into our garden area. Don't like the stone, but we'll do something about that. We might start doing this up into a pier like thing. I just don't know how the house is going to fit in with that quite yet. And of course, we need windows because it's not supposed to be a prison. But for now, I'm going to uh, pause it there. Buggy, I think you're the only one here. I'm just going to step away for five or ten minutes, make myself a coffee, come back and uh, work some more on the house.
Okay, coffee get. I'm back. Looks like Epic stepped back in for a quick more coffee per cool. Okay, uh I'm back. A little bit more building. For the next stage, we're gonna have to go hit up the oak part of our wood lot. Uh yeah, this is gross. How did this happen? Not a single sapling, I don't think. One. Wow. Okay, I think that's... No, that's not all the spurs. That oak got deprived of some leaves. <laughs> Alright, let's clean this up too, because it looks gross. We've moved the spruce part of the wood lot, so we shouldn't have this issue again. At least I'm hoping. Now, I'm wondering about this, because in the last world I did this... This normally works, and you get a huge block of it, but in the last world, this didn't work, and I don't know why. It could be because of foliage that's too close, so we're going to have to keep an eye on that. I need the oak, though. So normally, when I do up a house, I'll do just a flat surface for the wall, and then I'll use the detailing, the fence gates and the fences and the trap doors and the slabs and the stairs and everything else for depth on the wall. This time, I'm going to put an outside facing on it to kind of start the depth, and then I'll continue it with uh, the fence gates and everything else to add to it. But I'm hoping that the oak will be unstripped, uh, will be a nice start to the stripped dark oak that is the interior, and then I'll use spruce for the detailing. And then I think I'm going to want some unstripped spruce as breaks on the monotony of the dark oak walls. So I'll put a, a pillar of like uh, spruce logs there. But I'm going to have to make sure it does, the spruce doesn't show to the outside. So that'll take a little bit of planning, I think. Uh, I think I've got enough dark or oak saplings back in storage to replant this so i don't know that i'm too worried about saplings but i'll if i remember i'll check back and get whatever's dropped i don't think it's going to be too much because it's too close to that so i don't want to wait for it it's also cl too close to that uh okay let's see what we can do uh starting at the front Okay, see what we could do with this. Uh, I kind of want this to come around first before I don't want... If I'm going to do anything down at this level, if it's going to be a foundation, I don't want the logs going down that far. We didn't get as much from that as I thought we would. So, the roof won't go on until after the outside is done. So this is going to be roof line here. We're going to have to do something on the inside to fix the roof line, basically. I don't want one here. So we have one, two, three, one, two, three. Hmm. That's a little awkward, actually. Um, that'll work. We'll see what this looks like. That'll be... Ah, actually, that's four and four. That works well. Okay, never mind. That worked out just the way I wanted it to. Yep, that was planned. Um, we could put a spruce there, so we could definitely put one here. That'll put this three away, which is good ratio. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then what can we do? We can put one on the inside, and that would be a three. It would be a three that way. That works out well. So this will be a spruce one. That's a four. That's okay. We could put a nice double window in there. 
Uh, yes. I think I like that. I think I like that. What are we going to do here? This is going to be a full five wide, isn't it? We might have to put another one in the middle. Because this is going to be a short floor. Uh, there won't be a second floor to this. Only to the back part. So I think I'm going to do that. And I'll probably put windows on this, either side of this. So that we've got some lighting into the entranceway when we come in. Even if it's dark and stormy out. Um, speaking of dark, that is awfully dark. Okay, oh, that's a thunderstorm. We could sleep. I don't like thunderstorms. I got struck by lightning in one of the worlds. And I have heard that you can die by getting struck by lightning. So I don't want that. That should not be there. Uh, okay, one, two, three. Now nah, we'll just do it anyway. This is going to leave two. Uh, that's enough for a window in a corner, I guess, on the inside. Whoops. Um. Oi, really? We got no more dirt? Am I really running out of dirt? No. Oh, Kor, if you have any spare gold or rotten flesh on Restland that'll make M's. That'll make M. Oh! If you need M's, then just give me some spare gold or rotten flesh, if you could spare that much. Dude, I get uh, emeralds from my crates, so I think I literally have blocks and blocks and blocks of emeralds. So if you need emeralds, I think I got you covered. Uh, I'll have to double check when I get back into Restland in a few hours, but... Um, oh, that's the other thing. That one needs to continue up. Oh, wait. Maybe not. That'll be roof line, so that'll touch. This one needs to continue up. Okay. Um, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, if we did... What is that, then? That's... Uh, three threes, I guess. Is it? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, that works out well. Nice. Okay, so that's coming together nicely. That's the whole bottom floor. Um, the only thing is we don't have anything in the corner there. That's going to unbalance the look of it from the front. Yeah, I think I want to put one there, even though it's going to be a short one. It's only two there, so two here would work. Okay. Uh, not there. It's just going to be really hidden, but I think that would work. So we got a two and a two? Yeah, that will work. Okay. Uh, eat. I think, wait, uh, I think I get like 16 emeralds per VIP crate, but you get... A st yeah, I get a stack, plus I think the other bonus one that you get sometimes is like four or six uh, emerald blocks from Mythic Crates. So I should I should have a bunch. Like if you're, if you're short on emeralds, I should be able to give you a bunch. <laughs> I'm not using them for anything at the moment, so I don't mind giving them away. Uh, okay, so I think we got windows on the inside. I did want to take a look at doing... Okay, where are we? So it's going to be here, I think, for spruce. Is this oak? Yes, okay. So spruce there, and then one, two, three, spruce here. Now, how stupid is it going to look if I do spruce here as well? Actually, that's not bad. It's a little unbalanced from that corner. But I think it will work as a transition into here, particularly if I put this as a, an opening into the back. Okay. Um, so I kind of want some spruce up there now so I don't forget what I was doing with those spaces. One, two, three. And one, two, three. Didn't I have another one? I thought I had another one. Oh, yeah, over here. One, two, three. Uh, and then we want this one, too. Uh, 
And then we should be able to do this corner, which won't be visible to the outside as a break in this view. And then over here, we could simply do the two. Oh, that's oak. Oh, that's spruce. Okay. Okay, so now, is there enough spruce in here to break up? Yes. This looks a little weird. But I think if it's windows, just little tiny ones, and tables underneath, then it won't look too bad. Roof's going to be low. Oh! Okay, we'll see where the roof line is. I might just do spruce logs up to cover that gap that's going to end up in there with the roof line. Um, I think I'm ready for the roof line on the bottom, and then we're going to need the spruce. This is a stark contrast. The spruce would come in nicely in between. I've got any spruce planks on me? No, but I think we could show it this way. Uh... So that, as an intercession between this and that, will work nicely for decoration, I think. Uh, boom. And my axe is about to break. All right, let's do a roof line. Um, so the plan is, here, let's get up. Well, here, we'll just do it, and then you'll see the plan. I want, I think spruce is a trim and oak as the main part for this one, and then I'll do something else. I'm probably eventually going to take the trim off the roof of this and the top part and replace it with deep slate. I just like it better, being as it's in the game now. Um, we want that, and let's see about what are we going to need. Uh, we got uh, 11. We're going to need a fair number, so... Does that give us 24? That's probably not enough. Okay, that's a full stack. That should be enough. We also need some spruce doing the same thing. So we'll just do a bunch. That's probably going to be more. Uh, like that. And we'll hold on to... Whoops. Nice. Hold on to some. 36. That might be enough. Uh, because trading with villagers takes a lot of emeralds from my M supplies. But getting more villagers helps to get more items but if you have any villager jobs then spare them but i have brewing stands map villagers smithing tables so anything else helps uh okay you should try um you should try looking into zombifying and curing your villagers you will save massive amounts of emeralds over time it is well worth the effort of getting a zombie in fact it's well worth the effort of paying 64k to buy a zombie egg just make sure you name tag it. Um, but the amount that you save in emeralds by doing that is huge. Like, just huge. Wait, 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 wait. Am I being stupid here? I am being totally stupid here. Did we not do... Bamboo! Why am I doing this? I need scaffolding. Where, where can I plant bamboo? Actually, we cleared a pretty good space over here. Let's plant some bamboo. I'm dumb. I should have done that ages ago cow i should feed the cows too um this place looks good we don't need too much it grows pretty good yep we'll do that and then we'll make the rest oh i haven't got any string i haven't got any string uh we can't make scaffolding i don't have any string i am poor I am very poor. Uh, I guess, no, we'll leave that. Worry about that later. Uh, okay, let's do the roof then. We'll just use blocks. This is going to continue up to the roof line. We just got to see where the roof line is. Okay. Uh, we want, uh, yeah, we want oak. 
and then spruce on the inside. So, am I doing this right? No, I'm doing this wrong. I'm doing this totally wrong. This way. Yeah. And then we're going to have a really fat overhang for the roof. Uh, but I think by the time the decorations are put in and the planters out front, you won't really notice it. At least that's the theory. Of course, this is Minecraft. Theories rarely work. Uh. And then we're going to do our usual little jog. And that. And then that. And then we go down to this side and do the same thing. Ah, that's not the same thing. Okay. Nighttime coming on, it feels like. Yep. Uh... Beautiful. We'll continue this along down on this level to actually we should probably do that corner first. So like this and like this and I think we'll do a sleep right here on the edge of our roof. Living dangerously. Yep. Uh... Potions aren't expensive, dude. What are you talking about? Weakness potions? You don't even need uh, nether wart. Weakness potions are spider eyes, sugar, and brown mushrooms. We'll make a fermented spider eye. Brew that into your water bottle. And then... Actually, I think that's your weakness potion right there. Well, get better at brewing potions then, man. <laughs> I swear, like, you will save... I mean, think about it. If you're spending 16 emeralds right now, you could probably knock it down to four or even one. Think of how many emeralds you're saving. And with the amount of XP that you could get off a of villager trading, it's well worth the investment to learn how to do the potions. Um, take a look on the Minecraft wiki. There is a really good diagram there on the ingredients. That's not what I want. That you need for... Um, brewing and, and the, it, it, there's a really good table in there for it so check that out and and see if that helps you it's a graphic like a picture so you'll you won't be able to scroll through it or search in it or anything like that uh dooch, dooch, dooch. i've actually got a, a, a copy of the graphic saved to my my uh, pictures folder so I could just open that up anytime because honestly the one online is kind of a pain to work around in and it's the not very zo not zoomed very well um, I'm not sure if this is how I want my roof line to go Yeah, I guess so. We'll leave it like that. Uh, we just don't have... Yeah, I don't want my roof line to go like this because we don't have a center mark here. Um, hmm, how am I going to do that then? Yeah, take a look at the wiki. The, uh, honestly, once you get the hang of it, potions aren't that hard. But potion of weakness is one of the easiest ones to do. You don't even need nether wart. You do need blaze rods for fuel, blaze powder for fuel. But that's pretty simple to get. Hmm. The whole design of the roof is kind of a mess right now because that divider is not centered. And I don't think it can be centered. Can it? That would give three and three. It can be centered.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It can't be center. Oh, this makes it nine, though. It would make the center one, two, three, four, and there. Okay. All right. Let's do that then. That I think would work better than what I had in mind. That might give us a center to the roof. Uh, oh, we might as well take this down. It needs to move. All right. One, two, three. Unstripped. We got some stripped in here somewhere. Where is it? Stripped out log. Uh, one, two, three, and then oak on the outside, right? Let's take a look at that again. One, two, three. This should be equal. Nice. That should be equal. Nice. All right, we can use that then. Uh, bitch, we'll just do this, I think. Except I can't jump up on that, moron. There we go. Yeah, scaffolding definitely makes things easier. I'll get there eventually. We need to kill some spiders. Alright, and our little yep jog. So I like the fact that we could find a center there. That makes things much better. And then we go down to the other side. Now, the other side is not going to have the overhang, so we're going to have this part and this part, but that's it. All right. All right, and how high is that going to look? Because this peak is going to be higher than that peak, but in relation to the second floor, where does it end up on that wall? Quite a ways up. It's going to block out a lot of detail that we might add to that wall on the second floor. Um, <clears throat> what to do, what to do, what to do. Aha! What happens if I make that a balcony that you access from the second floor little staircase down small little balcony I could even incorporate a stair set down to the ground so we've got a second entrance to the house through the balcony hmm I don't know you're gonna have to play with this a little bit it it the uh, the meshing of lines is not working for me takes me a while to, to work around it sometimes. Uh, we need stairs. Wait, no, I made a bunch. I did make a bunch. Did I die? I died! Yeah, Pogs, I died. Uh, I died... I was playing last night. I was about an hour, hour and a half in. We had just located a... fortress in the nether after searching around for a good bit. Uh, I went in and it was it was okay. I was fine. I had my fire resist on. Uh, blazes were no problem. But it was over a lava lake, like the whole thing pretty much. And I wasn't paying attention to mob spawns. I noticed one area I went into was wide open. And mobs were literally spawning before my eyes. And yet, stupid me, I ran in anyway. The blazes were fine, but I had a team of... of four uh wither skeletons come around a corner at me at once like four blocks away no time to put up a barrier uh barely time to get my shield up i had wither in seconds and after that it was a second and i was dead yep so i just i should have uh once i realized that mobs were spawning like crazy i should have waited um hit them with bows and walked into a much cleaner uh, uh, area. But I didn't do that. So I died. So it's another one of those learning. Um, I started a new world. I was going to search on 
chunk base for a seed that I liked. And then I decided, fuck it, we're just going to go random. And so the seed that I put in was, I suck at hardcore, exclamation mark. And this is what we came up with. So we're going to go with it. Yeah, so I think I lasted like about maybe 120 days in that last one. It was rather sad. Just a bit. Yeah, oop is right. Uh, but whatever. I suck at, hard, at hardcore, but it's still a lot of fun. So I'm going to keep going until I get better. Oh, I need more. Uh, more of those. That's not going to be enough, but we'll start with that. And that's going to be our seam. So how is that going to work? What I'm thinking is the balcony. This roof line is going to block a lot of whatever I do with that second floor wall. So if I were to chop it even about here, which I think would be center almost, and just a little bit of an overhang, but then chop it down so it's just a balcony coming from the second floor, that might solve my problem. I just got to see what the roof line looks for, like first. Oh, bad. That's when you quickly Alt F4. Okay, that's a good trick. See, I I I haven't done hardcore enough to know that trick or even to think that that's in the brain. But I mean, you got to come back to it at some point, right? Uh, hey girl, just kidding. Wait, let me guess. Core did you die in last hard? Yeah, I died. I got swarmed by a bunch of wither skeletons in the end or in the nether uh at the first and only um nether fortress that we'd found i was keen on finding a blaze spawner to make a mini blaze farm like a janky blaze farm uh so that i could get xp and blaze rods and i noticed all the mob spawns i just wasn't paying attention to what that meant to my gameplay i didn't adjust my gameplay with the hundreds of mods mobs that were spawning around me which i should have so live and learn. I'm going to do it better next time. Hopefully. We'll see. I don't know. I say that, but I really don't know. Really? Why can't you go there? No, metal isn't showing up, apparently. Um, we were supposed to play on his server uh for a little bit today i tried setting it up on my system but it says can't connect so it's probably not online so i figured i'd start streaming hardcore uh and see if he joined up but i haven't seen him yet but that's fine we can set it up for another day so yeah this is going to str go straight into the wall um wait pog there was a rollback last night why? Oh, did I leave my crafting bench over here? D dumbass. Uh, Kur, can I get you some maps right now? How many do you want? Uh, me to get you right now when you get... Oh, um, I need nine for the billboard map that I want to put up behind Warp Core. So, just nine. I think the sizing of that... And those are just single zoom, so there's no zoom on it. Um, the sizing of that works well for, like, a display of what... The progress is on Atlantis. Uh, of course, there hasn't been a lot of progress except tearing down the mount or the monument at, so far, but that's okay. We'll get there. Uh, we need more of those. We need more oak. That's what I was going after. Uh, planks. Okay, that should be enough to finish that up. Let's do that. Uh, and we'll take this with me this time so I don't forget. Server crash, I don't know. Not last night. During the during the day today. Okay. Uh 
that sucks. There's going to be a lot of play. I mean, it's a new server. There's going to be a lot of players that are still like going hard with building. Now that peak is going to be higher than this peak. So I got to watch how this line transitions too. I just don't like building my, I, like if I was building my roofs out of, uh, out of solid, like full blocks, it would, it wouldn't be a problem here, but I don't like building out of full blocks. One, it's all spawnable. Two, close up. It doesn't look too good. From a distance, it looks all right. You don't notice. But close up, it doesn't look too good, in my opinion. Uh, hang on. Uh, messed up your base progress. Oh, you lost work? That sucks. I hate it when that happens. Every time. He perms too on the server too, but that kid is offline. Yeah, it, it, that, that's okay. I mean, he's got things to do. Uh, he invited me to play. I said I would. Today was going to be the day, but if that doesn't work for him, that's fine. Um, we'll find a day that does work for him another time. It's just at the time, I was really keen on finishing up some progress on the monument. But then I realized last night or yesterday when I was on Restland all freaking day, 12 hours I think I streamed for la yesterday, um, I realized the project was going to take considerably longer than what I had figured. Okay, so that went nice. How is this going to go? Um, awkward. Uh, still doing the base for mine. Wait, I didn't do my base. Rip. Uh, okay. I'm not sure what you mean by that. That, uh, looks awkward. Hmm. Can't really see that much of it, though, can you? But it does look awkward. What, what happens when we do the spruce? Did we run out of spruce? No. That does look awkward. I don't like awkward. I guess, whoops. Fucking stairs, man. Stairs and stairs and glass panes have got to be my bane to building existence. The number of times a slight elevation change just messes it all up is ridiculous. Um, this is going to be awkward, but it's only going to be that little piece. Actually, if we did a slab instead, that make it look a little better. Uh, where's my crafting bit? That's dirt. It's off saying, well, no, this peak line is one block higher than this peak line. So there's going to be a, a mesh that doesn't work. And the reason is because this wall is fatter than that wall. Uh, and I knew this was going to happen. It's just a matter of finding a reasonable way of working around it. Um, I think this should work well enough. If I don't look too close at this block, <laughs> this quarter block. But I mean, from far away. Cows, I'm coming for a visit. From far away. Yeah, from far away at ground level anyway, you can't even really see it. I mean, you can if you're looking for it. But I think I can live with it. I think I can live with it. What the? Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, let's get back up here and see where we're at. If I can jump. I can't jump. White man can't jump. Um, yeah, it's a little bit awkward. But I think I can live with it. And if it turns out that... I'm going to knock this down to just a porch and not a full roof line. Then I can definitely make adjustments here on where the roof line intersects. In fact, that might be the best way of solving both my problems. Make it into a balcony. That way I can make this roof whatever I want. This roof level whatever I want. Um, I'll worry about that in a bit though. This roof line is going to be higher. 
we got to figure out what's going on here. Um, I do kind of like the, uh, I'm starting that, that balcony idea is starting to grow on me. The only diff, the only problem is this is top of wall for this level. So that means at the very least next level floor is going to be one more up. So we're going to have one, two, three blocks. Oh, where, where's the, where's the damn wall? Where's the freaking wall? Right there. So we're going to have one, two, three steps down from up there to here to a balcony. Ah, hang on now. Where is this is edge? One, two, one, two, three. Um, we got a two here too. We could definitely make that work. Especially if I had a balcony up along this side of the upper floor where it just transitioned nicely down to this balcony, but also stepped down to the ground. It gives us another entrance into the house. Wait, uh, it's off center. Boy, oh, okay, Kur, why do you fly and build? Oh, don't, dude, don't get me, this is hardcore. Don't get me thinking like I'm on Restland. That's already killed me at least once. Um, Restland spoils you for any sort of survival play. It does. For one, who the hell in survival play, unless they've been playing that world for years, has two double chests full of shulkers that are empty and not used? <laughs> or fly, or any of the other things you get on Restland that spoils you for playing survival. I love the server, but I do find that, that I get spoiled. I get really spoiled. Um, so, I th yeah, I think we might just transition this back. Somehow, that transition might be interesting. But I like the idea of a balcony here instead. Okay, out the door and pick up the rest of this stuff. Um, okay, so we're going to take back this. We might leave a little bit. No, we can't leave a little bit because that's going to mess up the transition on there. So we'll just take it down. Aya! Fucking. I want scaffolding. Uh, I might do some in a bit, yeah. Uh, I was only going to spend a couple of hours on here and kind of waiting for to see if Metal showed up, but he hasn't. So I'll probably be on Restland later on tonight. Uh, do you want me to enlarge the nine maps for you on Restland? Or just, just leave them how you get them, because uh, uh, the nine, which is three by three, is perfect sizing for showing the entire L uh, island and the monument which means you're zoomed in as much as you can and you get all the detail of the changes that goes around because uh, that's kind of the idea the billboard one is probably going to be updated more often than the one that i've got at my base uh but it's designed so that anybody that comes into warp core to see what's going on can instantly look at the map and see what's changed that's kind of the idea behind it And yeah, I'm not too sure how it's going to work, but we'll see. I think it should be all right. Um, but I do want to get in and flesh out the idea of the, of the crystal a little bit more. Because once I get the one done, uh, the second one should go a lot quicker. Uh, and that is kind of taking the most of the time right now on the build i didn't realize that the so much of the function of the grinder was going to be whoops dependent on uh the look of the crystals i thought i could do the design of the crystals after i got the functioning done 
but yeah, it's not turning out that way. They're, they're going to be too intertwined. So it's just something I got to get on and grind away through the creative process, and then I can build up the second crystal. Uh, oh, we got more down there. Okay, so this is just going to hit the wall. This is going to come along and probably just... I think we'll just continue maybe two levels of this, or one level of this over. Maybe with some trap doors as a drop for a little bit of design. And this one will likely stop right here, I think. Have a little bit of an overhang into it. Maybe with, I don't know, something in the way of... Oh, this is going to be... Oh, okay, hang on. We got... We're going to have one more level of this going up so that the floor is up here. So we only got two stairs going down. That's even better. I like that even better. Um, okay, I think for now then, we're just going to do this. There's not going to be an entrance to the porch from inside the lower half of the house so i don't have to worry about breaking this roof line but i may want to push the roof line back so that we've got a wall that is the edge of the balcony kind of add some definition to it but i think for now just to get this part done i'm going to do this because i'm not going to be able to do the balcony up until the second floor is at least partially done all right so we have a roof and i think i'll probably end up taking two of these out and just doing a wall down underneath this or maybe one out and a wall down underneath this with this is overhang for the one that would be overhanging oh no that's level two it'd have to be up there okay and actually that's going to be if we put the floor in it's going to be that one can't go either oh well we'll figure it out we need one of those there and i think that's going to call done for the roof line on the bottom. Uh, it looks janky right now, but it'll develop into something better. Okay, so this needs to continue up. Where's our oak? Right there. Come on, get up there. That needs to go there. And then these need to continue up. Have we got any more of that stripped? Yes. Okay. Uh, and then we'll add decoration. I don't know if we'll add decoration tonight. Uh, that process can tend to take me a little while. All right, and like that. How are we looking? Windows and everything else will get punched through later. Okay, uh, that side's going to look janky, so we'll look at this side. And Actually, here, let's get rid of this. We don't need to up there anymore. Uh, wait, um... I'm in Discord voice chat and watching your stream and it's overlapping and I can't hear you. Leave the voice chat. Or deafen. Yeah. When players somehow join your hardcore world in Crystal PvP. What? Okay. People are alive. I've seen Crystal PvP mentioned a lot. I have no clue as to what it is. So could somebody in the know uh, fill me in? What is Crystal PvP? Like, PvP to me is just using weapons or fists and trying to take out the other guy. What am I missing? Okay. End crystals. And they explode it and attempt to murder each other. Ah, okay. I have seen that. I didn't realize it was called crystal PvP. Okay. Don't mind me, as Pogs put it. I'm a boomer. I'm a little slow in catching up on this. I'm not actually a boomer, but close enough. Uh, I am slow on catching up on s stuff sometimes. Uh, okay, I think that's going to work. Uh, we're not ready for the second floor. I kind of want to put a floor in on that, though, so that we can call that a storage area and move that in there and get going on that. Okay, I think there was an episode of the Dream Team, the Hunter 
series that I watched. It was the one where Dream ended up falling in lava with no armor on. He sunk to the bottom, dropped a crafting table, made doors, ate, and literally walked himself out of a pool, pool of lava while totally naked. It was absolutely amazing. He was down to one heart. But the end of that one, I'm pretty sure it was Obby and an end crystal that blew him up. And it was George that did it, I think. Totally a boomer. Yeah, whatever, Pogs. My parents were boomers. I can't be boomer. I think they called me a, like a, a Gen Z or some stupid thing like that, which means absolutely fuck all to me. But yeah, I think that's the term the media started using for it. Um, okay, so this one, it does look rather sturdy, robust. Corza. Corza. Okay, uh, let's see what we can do about punching a hole in here, I guess. Probably centered in three high would make sense. Oh, right, that was the other thing I wanted to do. This gap that we've got in the roof line on this side, I was simply going to solve with these, I think. I think it will work well. Uh, yeah. So, and I think it blends that part together. Uh, I might want to put it one over, actually. And then we can hide some lights up there or something. No, I think I want to put it one over. That would look better. So, oh, we need, we're going to need a few of these or this is going to drive me nuts. It's going to be janky curves all over the place. Uh, so here. And that one's going to be one of those. Where'd you go? Seriously? That's going to be one of those, and then we'll do that, and another one of those, and then we'll bring this one over. And we need more. Have we got more? We do not have any more at the moment. Hello, 911. You need a big pizza with Corza on it. Um, I don't know if I'd go good on pizza, man. Kind of greasy. Uh... There was, a, there was a pizza company in town called Pizza Construction for the longest time. They had one of the best pizzas I've ever tasted. It was called the Deep Dish Meat Lovers. And you order it, it comes delivered. You take a slice out, and I swear, the each slice of that pizza weighed about a pound. And it was nothing but mm, good, greasy meat. It was, uh, it was absolutely fabulous. The best pizza I've ever had. But, I mean, two pieces of that, and you were rolling on the floor like a lion trying to digest your food. <laughs> yeah. Um, that doesn't look weird at all, does it? We'll fix it. We'll fix it. It really should be an opening here, though, so maybe we'll fix that. Uh, stripped. Because that, yeah, it's got to be here. Okay, that looks a little bit better, and then we can have, I don't know, something in there. That's big enough for a crafting, or I mean an enchanting table, isn't it? Doot, 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 doot. Yeah, that's big enough for an enchanting setup, with room behind for decoration. Damn! I'm better at this than I thought I was. Not by much, though. <laughs> Not by much. Um... All right, so that I like as a transition into here. God damn, I need some torches in here. I can't even see in the middle of daylight. Uh, do, do, do. We haven't figured this one out yet. We haven't figured that one out yet. I don't like this. This is, yeah, it, in order to finish this part, this has got to go bye-bye. It's just not going to work. I was hoping to be able to save it until I got to the second floor, but I don't think I can do that. Uh... 
Do you know 99% of the world is not watching your stream? Um, I think your percentage is low. If I had 1% of the world watching my stream, I would be the biggest broadcaster on the planet. Are you kidding me? 1% <laughs> of the world watching my stream would be 70 million people. 75 million people watching my stream at one time. I would be the biggest broadcaster on the planet. I don't want to be the biggest broadcaster on the planet. People shouldn't listen. People in that number should not listen to me because it's probably not good for the species. Yeah, 100% is probably closer to it, dude. Replying to XJ, do you know, does it really matter? At least people are here. Damn straight. Damn straight. I, I And, like, surprise, too. Like, I I don't know why, but I thank you for being here. Um, Can I get that now? God damn it, just give me that. Um, Okay, that doesn't look gross at all. We're going to ignore that until we figure out what to do with it, all right? Nobody, no, nobody point out that. In fact, um... This is going to be a crafting area. It only needs to be too high, right? No, we kind of need it three in order to put a proper ceiling in. So three high. The floor is going to have to go up there. We haven't figured... Oh, they, they, there's a lot of night going on right now. Hang on. Where's my bed? I don't have torches up around. There's mobs everywhere. Uh, no, I don't care about viewers. I mean, I, I get, I do care because I get surprised. Like yesterday on Restland, I think I looked over and I had 10 viewers at one point. It's like, what the fuck? Uh, so it surprises me, but it, it, the fact that anybody shows up to watch me ramble. Yeah. All right. I mean, it's not like my gameplay is outstanding or anything. I tend to die a lot. Um, okay. Are we ready to move some stuff in here? Can I do that yet? Can we do it without a roof? I don't want to do it without a roof. We need a floor. What are we doing with a floor? Hmm. It's probably going to be spruce. Because I usually use spruce. I would really like some deep slate to add into it, though. And it needs to be slabs because I need to be able to open the chest. If I've got a five high chest wall... One, two, three, four, five. It needs to be slabs or stairs in order to open it up. So let's start with some spruce stairs because I got them on me anyway. Roof line is going to go this way. So this will look fine. Aye, that does not look fine. I lied. Um, and we need to check out... Now, th most of this is buried by dirt on the back. We're going into a cliff. This is an important one. I need to figure out where the spruce pillars are going to go to break up the look. But I kind of want to just put something in here for a roof so that I can put my chest inside and feel a little bit safer. And, and yeah. XJ and Coor, when can you play on my server? Metal, you're in the chat. I uh, I tried getting onto your server earlier. Uh, I put it into the the launch uh, manager, whatever it's called, the, the Minecraft launcher, and it came back saying it wasn't online. So I did try. I was th that's kind of the reason I'm streaming is because I was hoping that you'd come in and and say what's up. But to be honest, we're kind of late now. Yeah, it's six o'clock. I don't know that I want to get onto another server now because I still want to get onto Restland uh, tonight. So can we schedule it for another day? Like even tomorrow night for a couple of hours, Metal. You put it down for maintenance. Okay, can we do it for tomorrow night then, Metal? Um... Okay, that'll work, and then I want, I think I'm just going to do spruce slabs for the rest of it, and we'll worry about the look of it later. I just want a roof over what I'm doing. So, I'm going quick and dirty right now. Actually, it's not that quick. It's really dirty, though. 
Got a full, almost a full crop going. I want to expand this, I guess. Uh, la, 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 and la. I got one more. Come on. Have I got dirt on me? I got dirt on me. Uh, one more. Okay. Uh, give me the perms of the world. Uh, my alternates. So I can also start. Okay. All right. Um, it's not doing too bad. It's not doing too bad. Spruce plant or slabs. B trying to pretend like he's a helicopter. Ooh. Okay, we might have to hit the wood lot again. We're running out of spruce. Ah, I just made stairs. Okay, we have, definitely have to hit the wood lot because I just made stairs and we're out of spruce. I hope the wood lot is grown. The wood lot is not grown. Oh, yes, it did. Okay. All right, we got a whole shitload of spruce here. No problem. Uh, yeah, Metal, I think the reason XG was saying that is so that he, he could start up the server as well. But if you want control of that, that's fine. I mean, it's your server. So I don't know why this bank of spruce that I normally do for a woodlot like this uh, didn't work on the last world in a jungle biome. The only thing I could think is that the jungle trees with their foliage were overhanging the area just a little bit. It wasn't a lot, maybe a block or two. But I think that's the only reason, because as soon as I moved it to a different area that was totally open to the sky, it worked. It was, it was very strange. But I must have waited like a Minecraft week for those trees to grow, and then I finally gave up and moved them. is going to be enough for a while well we're up here though this is the first time we've really gotten a good look at the upper side there's some cave work over there it's not much of a mountain range i'm actually thinking if this build works out we might just make those peaks a little higher go cow um okay so there's definitely two levels here this will be second level there'll be a third level up there and then, get out of my way, I want to look, I want to look. Oi, ah, get, all right, better. Yeah, so first level, pier and docks. Second level, house and a few outliers. Third level, more industrial. And then we can have posh type stuff buried in the tree line up there. And we can extend quite a ways down there. Okay, that's if we get that far. We've got a long ways to go. Ah! I've been doing that a lot lately. I need some better tools. I need more iron. Uh, we're really not doing well in the way of iron at the moment. You died in your hardcore world. Yeah, I did. 
I got swarmed by a bunch of wither skeletons in the first fortress that we found. We were on the bla on the way to a blaze spawner, and we got ambushed. Basically, they came around. Four of them came around the corner, like three blocks away from me. I had no time to do nothing. Uh, I went from full health to dead inside about two and a half seconds. And then I sat there and stared at the screen for probably a good two minutes. Oh, we got five viewers. Nice. All right. Thank you, viewers, for showing up and keeping me company. I appreciate it. I'd be playing anyway, but I like company when I play. Sun's going. Oh, we broke through another one already. Damn, man. We're just chewing through these axes. Are we going to be able to finish this tree before the sun goes down? I've been caught in a tree at, dark, at night before, and it did not go well. I don't think we're going to get through this by sundown. We'll just sleep in a tree. Uh, no, don't give me perms to start it up. I'll wait for you to be around and available. Because you were, I, I was going to get on and you were going to show me around. So I'd rather do that. And we'll try and do it for tomorrow night. Like, about the same time that I normally stream, which is like 7 or 8 o'clock my time. Which is about an hour from now. Um, if you're available, then yeah. You can't send me a message on that, uh, um... Xbox app though, can you? You can only receive messages. Uh, maybe the best thing is I'll just uh, I'll log on to Restland, and when you're available, get on Restland, and then we'll bounce from there over to your server. Oh, hang on, coffee break. Oh, looks like maybe XJ and Metal left to play on the server. I know Metal at least can't do Twitch and the game at once, I don't think. Because he plays on an iPad. you there oh nope metal still here we lost a few viewers uh metal so like two so it could be he signed out of the stream at least according to the count that i see Buggy's good. I like Buggy. We helped Buggy build a base. She's still playing on Wrestland. Buggy is the first one to ever raid me. She's raided me a number of times lately. 
Uh, she's probably one of the most frequent viewers on my stream, just like Metal. Uh, she's been on Restland a number of times, in my streams on Restland a number of times. Yep, no, that's fine. And, and actually, uh, like, that's good, Metal, that you're doing that. Very good. Um, these days, you really... You really got to be careful in that kind of thing. Uh, it's just, I don't know. Reality is getting so chaotic. Uh, it's a good idea to be extra cautious these days. Although, just saying, if I had a server of my own that I was opening up to people, Buggy would be one of the ones I, I, I invited to the server. Is it just me, or is it taking like an entire Minecraft day to cut down these trees with a stone axe? Yeah, it does make sense, especially in this day and age. Like, with so how we're so connected in everything, you really don't know who's on the other side of the connection. So, in, in a case like that, better safe than sorry. Because sorry, well, sorry could get really bad. <laughs> Uh, yeah, in a bit, um, kind of want to get a little bit, well, I want to get to the point where there's a roof and storage in there at least, uh, before I call it done. I wouldn't mind taking another look that way on our little strip of land and see if I could find a mining cave. If not, I'll just dig one myself. It's just with stone tools, that might take a while. All right, we had a bunch of saplings that were just drifting out in the wind over here. Uh, kind of want to get them. And there were some up on, where was it? Up there. So can we get back? Oh, I can't, if I'm jumping like that. Nope. Screw it, we'll just do it this way. Oh, another axe. Uh, axe and... All right. Here, give me that. I want these. Thank you. Uh, did I see another one over here, too? Oh, way up there. Never mind. <coughs> uh, excuse me. Sorry about that. I need a mute button. I gotta figure out how to do a mute button. Just a toggle off mute button on Twitch from my mic. I haven't figured that out. I've tried a few things, but they haven't worked. Hey, Buggy, you stream. Do you know how to turn on, uh, like, set up a a toggle on, toggle off mute button for your mic on Twitch? So I hit it once, it turns the mic off. I hit it again, it turns it back on. Uh... I definitely do. I've dealt with lots of bad people who grief and kill for no reason or are just toxic in general. Keybinds inside of Minecraft or inside of Twitch? Yeah, there's ended up being toxic people on Restland. They don't seem to last long, though. The mod team does a pretty good job of weeding them out. Uh, 
okay, so if I go in here and controls, uh, keybinds, because I tried, the, there's, there's keybinds in OBS, and I tried using them, and it didn't work. Uh, I don't see anything for mic at all. Am I missing it? Open, close inventory, swap. Load hotbar, list, open, open. Advance, highlights, take screenshot, full screen. No, there's nothing in here for audio. Uh, is there something under sound then? Sprint hold, uh, sneak hold, auto jump off, mouse settings. What about under sound? Device system default, show subtitles. Nope. Uh, okay, I'll keep looking. Yeah, Minecraft Keybinds doesn't have anything for the mic in there. We were just in there. Options, uh, controls, keybinds. There is nothing in here for the mic for voice it's uh yeah it's all literally gameplay um yeah no it's all literally just gameplay is there something else i'm missing in here Video skin, resource, chat. What's chat do? Chat shown, colors, web links, prompts, chat, 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 command suggestions, hide. There's no audio in here. No. Oh, not. 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 Okay, so I got to look in the Twitch settings. All right. Um, I'll take a look at that. Maybe after the stream. I don't want to bounce out to do that. It might take me a bit because I don't know exactly where I'm looking. Um, all right, what are we doing here? Kind of wait for those to... Oh, we got 30. We don't need to wait for those to despawn. Okay. So, something like... Man, that took for freaking error to take down that block of wood. That's ridiculous. Where is... Get out of my way. Alright, good enough. We will take these and put them down in our chest. And then go back to what we were doing. Um, wow, we got a lot of stuff in here we don't need, it looks like. But don't need that much spruce. Okay, we need slabs, right? And slabs. Okay, uh, we don't have room to take that, do we? Okay, let's put that away for now, then. Okay. We could probably do better from up here, I'm guessing. Maybe. Yeah. Hang on. Oh, we don't have any room left. Never mind. Use up some slabs first. You suck. All right. We have a roof. We have a floor. Uh, actually, is this going to be the floor? This might be the floor. Let's see what this looks like underneath. I think we should still be able to open... If we have chest five tall, we should still be able to open the top one, which is all we need. Um, I think. Let's make some chests, I guess. We'll put those up. Put those up. Put that up, that up. Uh, slabs we don't need right now. We need a full stack of wood. So we'll do that. That. 
and we'll make as many chests as we could make with that that all right do 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 uh oh wow darkness this is good for me. i i just made a mob spawner in my house All right, so I think chest wall is going to go on this side. Furnace, it, uh, or a chest wall on this side, furnace on that side, buried in the hill, or maybe in this corner, buried in the hill, which is uh, whichever is going to be more accessible to me at the time. Uh, we'll get rid of that one, I guess, and go. Yeah, we're lit up enough. So one, two, and we just want to see if we can open the top one. I think. I'm not gonna be. I'm not even gonna be able to place the top one. Hang on now. Does that need to be slabs then, or do I? I could just go with a shorter chest wall. How's that? That's probably a better idea. And then we'll just put barrels up for add-ons on either side. Are you? All right, that's four. We need 10 more chests. We should be able to do that with what we... Oh, darkness. Wow, cool. Um, Hello. Mm, I hear cows going, which reminds me we should probably feed them. Uh, we're not using the steak very quickly, but we're going to need leather in large numbers at some point fairly soon i'm hoping hello cows hey, hey what are you trying to do skip out on getting laid you dumbass all right Oh, creeper. Hi there. Um, I need my shield, I guess. I really don't want you in my farm. All right. Any more? All right. Uh, what are we doing? Five more chest, uh, ten more chests. Ten more chests. We might do a little bit of an archway here in this bit of the roof because this is kind of low for what I'm used to walking into my house with. Alright. How do we end up with two extra? Oh, because I was counting five and we're not using five, we're using four. Good enough. We can move our shit in. We'll take all of that and all of that and fill up our inventory with whatever we can get out of here. Okay. Alright, so I think we're going to probably do stone... Uh, stone here. Oh, oh, wait a minute. No, we'll do the uh, andesite one. We can skip the cobble, maybe. But andesite definitely going up there. Is it? That's all andesite. Stone going down there. We're going to get a lot of it. Uh, cobble up. On that one. Oh, we're not going to have the dirt one, then. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Uh, all the wood. All the wood. All the wood goes in there for now. And we got two crafting tables. We need one right there. And the other one in our hand. Yep. So dirt. Um, 
don't like not having my dirt one, but we'll do that. Uh, furnaces. Furnaces. For now, furnaces is just going to go in the tools. And then we got mob drops here and food there. Okay. And I think we'll just do this. Speed up the process some. Okay. So, shiny valuables, shiny valuables, shiny valuables, shiny valuables. Uh, greens and such. And drops from other things. Alright, dirt, I guess, going down here. That's going to fill up rather quickly, I think. Um, books, or, yeah, we'll put books in there for now. Uh, obsidian up there, and more woods. Wood, wood, wood. Bed, bucket, coal, torches. All right. Alright, so that, that, uh, that's andesite, and that's cobble, so cobble, andesite, whack load more wood products and stuffs, and some shiny, and the blocks of coal can go up there too, we'll figure out valuables later, we do have a few arrows, we don't even have a bow though. I think we'll put those in there for now. Bones will go in there for sure. Seeds will go there, and trees will go here. Did I get the trees mixed up? I did get the trees mixed up. Okay, they'll go there with leaves. And... Yeah, how much iron we got? We got three pieces. Uh, actually, we got five pieces. Okay. And I think we just got wood left. All right, wood left. Um, I want to do that all whole area up in dirt so that we've got a nice, better farm area than this janky setup that we've got here. So I think I'll do that next because I'm storing too much dirt right now anyway. Uh, there. So we got three stacks of dirt, two and a half. Let's go see what we can do with this. Use something other than our axe for a little while. All right. It's not the same as it was, but that's okay. I'm not sure how we're going to make this look. I guess we're going to fill this in. But I figure I, we need a bigger area, and this is kind of naturally suited for it, I think, if we fill it all in. That went one too far. We'll fix that. Come on, give me that. All right. I don't know why you're running away from me. Okay. Come on. Get up. Uh, li -li -li.
All right, let's worry about this border first. That should be it, right? Yeah, all right. Um, I want this part, but it's going to be water, so... Hmm. We will just go with this for now. Expand it again later. I would like to get out and see if I can find a cave. Kind of want to know whether or not I'm going to have to dig down into a mine or whether I could just find one and use that. Take this down back to this part as what one more, and then we'll do the same here. So we're not st uh, we're not stepping down in or jumping down into our garden. Okay. Uh, should be good, I think. We got water all the way around it. It should cover for one, two, three. I think most of this is going to be tillo like tillable with a, a hole right now. So we'll just do it and then see if there's any parts. Leave it for a bit. See if there's any parts that uh, need redoing. Need water close to it. Dolphin flying through the air over there, having fun. Good to see. You. Uh, let's do this because that's going to piss me off. All right, come here. I think there's a center line down here that might not get touched, but we'll see what happens in a few minutes. All right, I am going to. Uh, finish this up, go in the house, sleep, oh, go in the house, sleep, um, actually, I'll just sleep here, I need to make something anyway, I'm going to take a break for a few minutes, so who's left, oh, everybody gone, that's okay, off to bigger and better things, I need that, it looks like someone's still left here, who's still left, is anybody talking that's still left? Uh, okay, we'll see what of that needs water, and we'll just go sit in the house for a little bit. I'm going to have a smoke. I'll put it on pause. Uh, away from phantoms. This will work. I think this will work. We'll have a doorway over here, going back into more, and then our furnace bank, I think, will be here. Yep, I like it. All right, I'm going to pause. I'll be back in about uh, 10 minutes.
Okay, I'm back. Nice little short break. Uh, looks like Tracker joined. Pogger's still here, apparently. Um, I'm not going to worry too much about this. It looks gross. But now that I've set this chest wall up, I had a thought. The only wall that we can really put windows on for this area is this wall here. Because this wall has all that. And this wall is cliff or dirt and dirt. So we either go with a full dark area. Which is fine. We could just light it up. This is our work area. It doesn't need light. Or I move this over to that wall and the furnace wall goes on this wall and we put windows in this wall. But I think for now... I'm not going to do that. I'm, I want to get some materials. So what I want to do is punch through right here. And on the ground behind here, we've got the wood lot. There is a divot that I don't want to run into. So I'm going to do staircase down for five blocks starting here and then we're gonna this is gonna tunnel back to our machines we are gonna have redstone in this world I refuse to have a world without redstone this time so there will be machines back here probably one of the first is gonna be kelp or melons and pumpkins depending on how we do with uh, villagers and trading and our mine is also going to be back here. I decided that I'm just going to dig down, use that until... if I mean, if I come across other places where I can go loot for materials, then I will do that. But I'm not going to do it right now. Right now, I'm just going to dig. We need materials anyway. Uh, I want to get down at least to level uh, 32 and see if there's any iron about there because... Who was it? Gamer game, game Timer was on last night for when I started this world. He was with me for about an hour. And he said that Y32 is a really good level to find iron at, which is our current goal. Diamonds will come later. Okay, what do we got? One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. We'll get some spruce stairs, because spruce seems to be what we're using, and I like it. And we'll just do this up really quick, and then tunnel straight back, just to the point of where, about where I want the, the mine entrance to be, and we'll dig down. Not going to make it look fancy, the fancy part will come later, a lot of fancy parts will come later. For now, this is good enough. Uh, let's get rid of some of this so we don't fill up our inventory too quickly. Uh, we're gonna need. Oh, we're gonna need four picks. Actually, we, we're, we're gonna get more for picks. Gravel. Uh, for the moment, I guess gravel's gonna go in there. We got more shiny and flint. We don't have a source of arrows yet, so I'll hang on to that. And I guess I don't need wood on me. Uh, oh wait, I do need a fair number of torches. So let's get. Yeah, all of that, I guess. And we'll just take a stack of whatever wood we've got available. We've got a lot of spruce, so that's good. I don't need my hoe. Well, that, that, that's a tool. I was thinking of hand, setting up the, the furnace bank, but uh, we haven't got anything to smelt yet, so that's not important. Uh, and then we're just going to go straight back this way. I'll eventually turn the floor into spruce or whatever I decide to make the floor out of, but for right now... We're just going to do this. I'm hoping down low enough we can have a nice high ceiling. So that I can put a little decoration in. I expect that along the line I'm going to... This will stay three. We'll decorate up the walls, obviously. We'll branch this out to be seven wide at some point. Um, I like wide tunnels when you're underground. And that means that if we're doing seven wide, we have to space our mine entrance accordingly down the hallway. And we're going to have it on this side, actually, now that I think about it. OK, 
Okay, and I think some lights would be in order, probably three away from the bottom stair. So that gives us one, two, three, four, five, four, five. Uh, that's not enough. I don't think. And that's the first one gone. Where's a crafting table? Just one. Almost made a bunch. Okay, coal is good. We're not going to pick it up quite yet. We could come back. Actually, we might leave it there till we either put the floor in or till we come up with fortune. Uh, so a five block is kind of nice when you're stretching it out seven. Uh, so a five block would be there, which means two, three, four, five, yet. Yeah. This would be the first into our entrance. We want the entrance. I think I want it probably seven to make sure that I've got plenty of room for decoration to make it look like a mine. I'm seeing dirt there. I hope I'm down low enough for this. So that's one, two, three. I need four more. Cobble will not be a problem for a while. Lots of dirt showing up. I hope we're low enough. We look like we might be. I want to make sure that I've got room to take that top layer out, put some decoration in, because I kind of like high ceilings. High ceilings and wide corridors, if I could get away with it. And I'm also hoping that as we dig down, we're not going to run into what we run into a lot when we dig down, and that is water-filled caves. 1.18 has a lot of gorgeous caves. It also has a lot, a lot, a lot of water-filled caves. All right, so uh, here, let's do a mark. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So this is start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that means one, two, and three in the middle. And that's our entrance. And then we're going to go back nine. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'll just put a torch down there. And then one, two, three. Okay, we're just going to open up a little area. I'm not going to dig this all out now. Beautifying a mine can happen later. It's not important. Uh, making it usable is important. Okay, so I'm just going to dig down a 3x3. Three three, the way you normally do when you just start out. Eventually, though, this should be big enough and placed well enough where we're going to have bubble vader and 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 so on to get up and down and there might be a few different layers depending on what we find down below but for now i think we'll just start it here and work down and another one gone another one bites the dust Got 16 crying obsidian for you. Okay, cool. I will be on. I'm figuring another half hour here. I want to see if I could get down to Y32 and find any uh, iron. Uh, if not, the mine will be started and I'm good to end the stream there. And I think I might just pause it for uh, five minutes and then bounce straight over to Restland. So I should be there in about a half hour, maybe 45. I got to stop by with a list of stuff that I've got for uh, Epic as well. He's got a monument he's clearing, so I'm going to give you some of the supplies that we use to clear my monument uh, to make his job easier, and maybe give him a hand too. I, I, I don't know if I'm going to work on the Guardian Farm all that much today on tonight's stream. I'll help uh, Epic for a bit and just kind of see how it goes. Um, but yeah, I'll stop by. Oh, wait a minute. Did I go too far? One, two, three. I went too far. God damn it. We'll fix that later. Okay, I kind of want light there because this is getting dark. Cool. All right. 
Um, Tracker, yesterday you said you were starting on the second floor. How's your second floor going? Andesite, I like andesite. Really good. Okay, uh, I might even plan a visit. Stop by and see how you're doing, because I would like to see it. Iron! Yay! What level are we at? 45. Well, we'll take it at 45. I don't care if it's not 32. Uh, we'll continue down, though, and see if this opens up into more iron. At least get my count right for my staircase. Uh, iron. And more iron. Okay, we're up to seven pieces of iron that we can use. Uh, keep going. That's, uh, we already got, oh, we got that. So that's a pair of pants if we want. We kind of need shears, though. Uh, I want to start doing leaves pretty quick. For decoration. So I'm going to be looking for that right soon as well uh interior out oh, interior outer part almost done okay is epic still in the chat epic are you here i think he's probably one of the ones that left went back to restland a little while ago i was just gonna tell him actually tracker you're in restland right can you let Epic know that I'll be there in about a half hour? 45 minutes? I think I want to take this down three more. Okay. Cool. Uh, and make this my opening because it's a nice landing. And that looks like 32 right there, I bet. Yep. Ding, 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 ding. Game timer was right. I like it. Uh, I guess we'll put the torch there this time. Look at this. Iron. We have iron. I'm so happy. It's the little things in life when you're playing Minecraft. All right. Um, should we just do... How many we got? Ten? Let's just do a punch hole. Oh, what do we got going on here now? Is this a cave? Oh, we might have to explore a bit of a cave. That might be a thing. We got zombies up top. That is a lot of up top. Or iron. More zombies. Okay, I want to light up and see what's going on there. The zombies can continue their trek on downwards. But, uh, this will take some work to fix up. <clears throat> uh, that's disgusting. Just saying. 16, is that enough? What do we need? 9, 12, ah, 16. That's enough for a full set of armor. That's probably a good idea right now. I'm going to go cook up some iron. Oh, hang on. I guess our entrance is here. Here, let's fix this so we don't get confused again. All right. Yeah, 1,500 ping is uh, kind of shitty. Uh, Pogs was saying, maybe you already know this, Pogs was saying they today they were having issues. They had to roll back the server an hour. Um, it would have only affected people that were active on the server at the time. Um, but apparently, like, Pogs lost a bit of a build. Um, whoops. Can I do this? So maybe they're still having issues with whatever caused that in the first place. Yeah, I was, uh, I, uh, was affected. You were affected by that. How much, did you lose a couple of hours of work too? 
because I mean, when you go, you go pretty hard. So I could, I could see that. Um, what do we want? Where do we put the furnaces? There we go. We'll just plunk them down here for now. And actually, I think I'll make the furnace over there so that when I do decide to move this, if I do, eh, I don't have to move the furnaces as well. But for now, this is good enough. And we'll do two of them. And we'll get rid of some junk like that. Andesite, no. That's gravel. That's andesite. Dirt, yes. And we don't need that much cobble on us. So andesite and cobble. And we'll hang on to one. That should be all we need. Uh, it's just mine hut. I'm still recovering. Oh, that was a mine hut thing, Pog? Okay. Uh, we're still good on... Um, We should probably make some more... Another pick, at least. I want to cook this up and fabricate. And we'll be full iron, finally. We still need tools, but we're working on it. And we found a cave. That might be good for us. It might be deadly, though. Hmm. Thinking ahead, let's put the shield on now so we don't forget. Okay, so that is a helmet. Good. And then that should be a pair of pants. Uh, pants. Good. We'll do that and that and eat. Uh, and then we got two and four for boots. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, we do need clippers and then we need, or clippers, uh, shears, and then we need uh, the rest of it. So machine area down that way, mine area down this way, and level 32 opened us up into a nice cave to explore so we'll do a little bit of cave exploring not too much because i don't want to die oh got to put the boots on dum dum and away we go we only got a janky axe actually you know what just so i don't run into trouble i think i will make a new janky axe and save that one for repair purposes uh, okay, let's see if we can light up a little bit here. Let's get an idea of what we're looking at. Up in here. Ow, that hurt. This definitely needs some. What else? We got a little bit of up. It looks like it's nighttime. Can we do... Oh, not there. There. Lost the torch. I'm not too worried about that. We'll just fall down. Okay, is that all we need for that? I want to sleep to make sure I'm not getting anything coming from above, I think. We got skelly bobs here, so maybe get in here and sleep. Uh, not sure how I'm going to deal with skelly bobs if they're that far away. They're going to have a lot of shots on me before I get to them. So, how are we going to get down here? I guess we could use water. How deep is that? And we got creepers involved, and it doesn't look that deep, so... Um, let's go over to this side first. And just make sure that we're not going to have issues with lighting here. Or down... Kind of here. He's got an enchanted bow. He's going to hurt a whole bunch. Uh, there is another one down there. Why is it always creepers and skelly bobs? Seriously, why? Why is it always creepers and skelly bobs? Uh, where'd that creeper go? He's still up there with the skeleton, so... Alright, let's see if we can do... a creeper kill. The skeleton sort of thing. We'll do that. Oh, you caught sight of me already, and so did... Oh, and so did the creeper. Alright, uh... Alright. That hurt you. I like that. Who else is shooting me? Oh, you're shooting me. Alright, damn it. This is going to hurt. Alright, that's one. Oh, come on. Whoa! Why? 
Why am I that low? Get me over to the side here. Get me out of this water. Ow! Can they shoot through water? Oh yeah, shoot the other guy. Thank you. Ah, don't do that. All right, come on. All right, we only got one of you left. Let's see if we can do this without dying. My shield is almost done. All right. Oh, my shield is almost done. Yeah. All right, get up here. Eat. Make sure we're safe up here for the moment. My shield is almost done. I need some more iron to make a new shield. I'm not going to last long without a shield. I knew this getting into this cave was going to be hard when I saw Creeper and all the skelly bobs. What do we got up there? Is that an ending? Yes, that's an ending. Okay. Okay, this cave looks pretty big, actually. I see some iron. Let's light up around the iron so we can get the iron safely. There's more iron. We'll move the lighting down further. There's more iron. I like... Li oh, are we already... Damn, we're already down to deep slate level. Holy crap. I didn't think... I thought that was like Y level 2 or something. Okay, we got another opening up here I want to light up. Lots of iron. All right. This is good. What is in there? Another opening. Okay, we'll check that out later. This is kind of a safe zone. We'll eat some more. And gather up the iron that we got here, which is a lot of iron. That's a pick. That's a sword. That's a shovel. That's another pick. And that's a pair of shears. Okay, so we have enough iron to be fully geared now. And shout out to Game Timer for accurately telling me that Y32 is a good level to get iron at because he was so right um, in so many ways. Yeah. Um, I did not realize we were down that far in the world, though. Seeing Deep Slate was a surprise. Come here, then. I want you... Actually, I want to get rid of those two just in case spawns. And just in case spawns. And some more coal. Or torches. There we go. All right. How are we doing? Uh, there was darkness here. That continues a bit into deep dark so we'll just kind of do that for now not too worried about exploring that too much uh wait wait okay come on come on get me out of here i want up on this level did this go but no it didn't so we'll just do that uh a little bit there maybe and then we got down here what do we got that's still lit this needs some love uh this needs some love oh baby baby All right, baby dead. Children in Minecraft are, uh, yeah, shoot the zombie. Shoot the zombie. Yeah, shoot the zombie. Go kill the, go kill the skeleton. Be a good little undead slave. Minion, whatever you want to call it. While you guys are otherwise engrossed, I will run around you. Hopefully not getting shot or blown up by a creeper and light the place up. Okay. A little bit of eating time. And diamonds! Diamonds! Already! Do I have an iron pick on me? I do. Woohoo! Diamonds already! Wow. It's at a weird level too. Only one. Only one, but I will take one. Diamonds! I was looking for iron. I really didn't expect to find diamonds on this run. Iron. Uh, let's get that out of there. I don't want to use it up. Let's put that one. Actually, hang on. Let's uh, 
repair this and get some more iron. Okay, good, good, good. Diamonds. I did not think we were going to get diamonds. We have not been very lucky with diamonds. Really? So is this like an underground cave? This is definitely an underground cave. Filled with water. Um, I think we'll block that back up for our own safety and peace of mind. Uh, okay. Uh, iron all over the place. Coal all over the place. Is this safe up here? This is all downward drop, right? It's not shelf type thing. I don't want anybody dropping on my head. Okay, so that's all safe up that way. I don't really need coal at the moment. I kind of want to leave it for fortune. Uh, there's some areas over there we're going to have to check out as far as drops. Okay, checking time. I got about 10, 15 minutes left. So let's see how much of this we can do in 15 minutes. We'll try and light it up so that coming down here next time is going to be super easy and a breeze. Not deadly. And then probably go up and start smelting our iron. We we have oodles and oodles of iron. And gold, apparently. We'll take gold, too. So does this mean maybe we can upgrade from full stone to full iron? Are we going to have enough iron to maintain our picks and tools out of this? I guess would be the question. Um, only time will tell. So, oh, that takes iron, doesn't it? Or, I mean, yeah, an iron pick. Jesus, you scared the piss out of me, Enderman. Uh, it's, I, that, I, I did that totally wrong for safety. We're at level 8. Wow, okay. I didn't think we'd be getting down that far. Alright. So, iron get. I like. Let's switch this out because I keep using it. I don't want to. Oh, zombies. Hello. You got fancy gear on. You got thorns on. A lot of good it did you. Oh, this is going to be floating gravel. So I guess we'll take some gravel for flint. Because we don't have arrows yet. We're not a supply of them. Ow! 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 Dude! Not nice! Are we... I thought we lit this... Oh, well, apparently we didn't light up as much as I thought we did. Creepers! 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 I wish I had a bow. I like a bow when you're dealing with creepers. Um, Enderman. How you be, man? Normally I would just let this gravel sit, but I noticed iron behind it, so I want the iron. So, if we need it, that should, or when we need it, uh, that should keep us in arrow supply for a while, I think. Uh, got a fair bit of flint out of that as it was. Seven. That's 28 arrows, I guess. Uh, that looks like it needs some loving up there. Loving, loving. There we go. Okay. Uh, a little bit more iron here. And a little bit more gravel there. And there's no holes I gotta worry about, right? No drop holes? Why is that so dark? Wait a minute, what's this? Is that just ceiling dark? Yeah, that's just ceiling dark, okay. Okay, as long as we got no droppers on us, we should be fine. 
Is that hole good? These holes are all good. These are a little dark, just to make sure. Uh, all right. Creeper is there. Let's see if we can coax him down to some place battle worthy. Oh, there he is. There we go. That shield is going to need replacing, but we have iron to do so now, so I'm good. All right, not worried at all. Not even just a little bit. Well, maybe a little bit. Just because of past history, you know. Uh, okay, so going down now. And more down. There's a lot of down without mobs here. That's kind of surprising. Oh, there's mobs. All right, we'll turn around and go back. See what kind of we got iron there. Copper. There was more iron there. Is creeper. Creeper's not following, so let's do some mining. I think... Uh, that might be the end of how far we go deep wise. I might want to take a look at what's down there and, and coming up, being as it's getting into deep slate. Maybe take an eyeball around, see if we can see some surface diamonds, and then take our loot and go home. I should probably have the iron on a different hotbar key that's easier to access. And where's Creeper? Creeper is still there. Okay. Uh, we got iron up here to deal with. Uh, yeah, I want that on a different key. So what is that, five? Yeah. Okay. How are we doing on iron? We got a full stack plus 17. I think we could safely say we are fully into the iron age and using iron tools now. We've got enough for backup. If we ever need more and run out or look like we're gonna run out, we can, we've can. we already got a mine down to level 32 and it looks fairly safe for the most part. So we can safely go in and just plow through a few thousand blocks worth of world and, and looking for more iron. Um, and I'm not joking. I'm not joking. Many of my mining trips are just, we'll go 10 blocks of 10 and do that 10 times. 10 blocks of 10 before you go back and mine out whatever you find. And then do that 10 times. That's a good mining tra trip. It takes about an eh, hour and a half. Um, turn around, go home. And that's a thousand blocks. And in a thousand blocks, you could get a pretty good idea, at least cave wise on that level of uh, what kind of mob spawning is going on just by the, the noises you hear along the way. Okay, I don't see any more iron that we're leaving behind. I do see copper. I don't need that right now. I've got a fairly good supply and no use for it. Uh, yet. Yet. I do plan on using it, but not yet. Okay, so I think I kind of want to go down and just get a surface look at what is down here. Uh, okay. So, yeah, maybe another... Another 15, another 10 minutes, we'll say. And then we're going to uh, take a five-minute break, bounce over to Restland after that, and see what's going on. We've got a, a couple of people to go see for various reasons. Um, and maybe help out Epic with his monument clearing. Him and a buddy are working on clearing a monument. So team up and make it faster, at least for part of it. Wow, this goes long way. Long, long, long way. La 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 long way. Okay, uh, long, long, long way. I like surface looks. I don't think I want to go down in there right now. Let's just make sure that this is safe for us running back in heedlessly next time. I won't take lapis right now. Don't need it. Rather come back with... Ah, diamonds, 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 mobs. Uh, 
Uh, mobs. Mobs. Ah, uh, mobs. I got it. I, damn it. I can't do a shield while I'm trying to eat. Or where? while I can eat. Alright. Zombie. You, I can handle. I'll go deal with your undead cousin later. Gimme. Come here. You dumbass. You too. Oh, you got a sword. You didn't drop a sword? That would be really cool if you didn't. Okay, that's fine. Uh, just got back, and do you want those nine maps enlarged to the max, or should I just... Leave them normal. Uh, nine is a perfect number to completely uh, encompass my island. So it doesn't need to be any bigger. And it's it's perfect for showing the detail as well as things change along the way. Ah. Is that an opening that needs lighting? Yes. Okay, we saw diamonds. I want I, I want more diamonds. I'm not greedy or anything. Uh, and epic. I should be in on Restland in uh, about 10 minutes. 15 minutes. So I'll bring the loaded stuff that we talked about. And uh, I got a couple of other things to do, but then maybe give you a hand with the monument clearing. Oh, creeper. I shouldn't have come up here because I wanted the diamonds. But Oh, two creepers. Wow, you've been moving in tandem. What the fuck is... Did, did... We got organized creepers going on here. Paramilitary creepers are now in Minecraft. Uh, okay, hang on. I'll check chat in a second. Creepers problem. Creepers problem. Where is the damn diamonds that I saw? Creepers problem. Uh, okay, I leave. I, ha I have 15 in case you need more or mess it up. I'll try and get some more carrots and items to sell the villagers. Okay, I'm going to load up on emeralds and a bunch of other stuff to bring you. So that part should be easier for you, I think. But we'll see. Creeper, you need to die because I want those diamonds. All right, that shield has n damn near nothing left on it. Where are those diamonds at? I know I saw diamonds. Where the freak are the diamonds? I don't know how that died. I don't know where my diamonds went. Where'd my diamonds go? Oh, they're down here. Okay, I hadn't lit it up yet. All right, I was working my way around to it. Let's do some more torches. That's not torch materials. I need sticks first. Okay, that should be good, and we'll do up that, then that, then that, and hope that we're not just standing here in the open with mobs surrounding us. Okay. Good enough. There's one, two. Hopefully there's more behind. I want to light up a little bit back here just for safety's sake. Without looking at the Enderman. Okay. There's more up that way. All right. Okay. Diamonds. And then I think we're going to head back to base and start the smelting. Oh, hang on. Start the smelting process. And then uh, we'll, we, I, I won't end the stream. I'll just pause it for five minutes and then come back in Restland. If anybody wants to stick around and watch a little Restland action. Uh, so we got four diamonds out of that run and we ain't done. I like it. I like it a lot. There's a whole bunch of black up there. Okay. There's plenty of work for us to do and plenty of for us to explore next time. And the great part about this is it's all right under our base. We don't have to go anywhere. It's just right there. So we're going to head back to base now. See if we can make our way up that waterfall again and hit the landing oh we gotta eat we got five viewers hello viewers glad you could make it we're uh 
We're minutes away from ending this part of the stream. I'm going to pause the stream and then we're going to show up back on Restland after this. So if you want to stick around, I'm going to take a break for about five minutes after we get some smelting going up here. And then we'll be back in Restland and seeing how the world there is going. Uh, we got some people to see, some things to do, and a little bit of work to do, maybe, if, if I feel so inclined. Um, we got a bit of a jump stair thing to do first, though. These are always fun. I'm glad they only last through the first part of your world, and you usually have a better method later. All right. <clears throat> Hella good run, much better than I wanted or expected. We got all the iron we need for now. We got four diamonds. That is enough for a pick. Uh, it is not enough for a table yet, but we're, we, we haven't got enough XP yet anyway, so I'm not really in any rush to get a table going yet. I guess Deep Slate's gonna go in there. Wait, have we got anything there? No, Deep Slate's gonna go in here. Uh, and we're in, gonna end up with some silk touch ones, so we'll do that to make it easier in the future. We got some gold going, we're gonna smelt up all the coal. Bones don't need to be in there, or the coal. Yeah, the iron, the other coal. Uh, shinies, shinies, mob drops. And I think we're good. So how many we got? That's eight. And that's going to be, well, here, we'll do the four off. Because one, two, three, four. <clears throat> so that's eight and three is 11. So that's, uh, what, five? And then six. So we'll do, that's eight. So that's five, and then the rest is six. Okay. So that one's six. That one's five. That's going to require two of these. So we'll just... Well, hang on. Do it that way. All right. So it's cooking. We're obviously not going to wait for it to finish cooking. We'll do up a full set of iron gear uh, next stream, which will probably be tomorrow night. Uh, and a new shield. We need to remember to do the shield. In fact, have we got one right now so that I don't forget because that would happen? Uh, we got two of those. Have we got, yeah, there we go. What, why are you picking up arrows? My mouse is, is got a mind of its own. Six. Uh, shield. All right, so now we got a new shield. We'll keep this one around just for repair purposes, I guess. Um, okay. Five minute break. I'm going to end this part of the stream. Save and quit. Five minute break. I'll be back on Restland in about five minutes. We'll jump in, go see some people, do some things, and maybe a little bit of work. But we'll see how things are going there. Uh, so, yeah, back in a bit.
Okay, I'm back. I did realize something when I was gone, though. I am going to shortly, just for a quick bit, end this stream because it's a hardcore stream currently. Uh, and then I'll start it up again as a Restland stream because I want to be able to save it as separate uh, when I move it around and play with it and so on and so forth. So I'm going to switch over to here. End this stream. I'll be back in like two minutes.